Welcome to the Keepers of the Golden Gate, session 23. I am Ryan, the GM. It is the 11th of October, 2019, and here are the players. Hi, I'm Callum, and I play Lord Eric Greenwood, the human sorcerer. Hi, I'm Adrian. I play Arya Bluebird, who is the half-elf druid. Hi, I'm Scott. I'm playing Crumb by the uh, half-orc paladin. Hi, I'm Sophie. I play Kitty Kill, a wood elf rogue. Hi, I'm Stuart. I play Reach, a half-elf monk. My god, that was almost the best intro we've ever done. Um, <laughs> sorry, sorry for the almost burst of laughter there. It just sounds so weird hearing Sophie say that. I know, it feels weird saying it as well, still. I'll be honest, I'm still oh, used yeah, to Tabaxi rule. Goog. Right, let us remind ourselves what happened a last time. So, Callum, you've probably got the most... Uh, Freshest recall, right? <laughs> Probably not. Um, <laughs> so, big infernal dude. Well, infernal speaking dude. Mm -hmm. That is red with no, with just the armor on. Mm -hmm. um, tries to speak to Arya. Arya blocks him because different language. Clearly, massive language barrier issues. Mm -hmm. uh, Kumba repeatedly tries to hit it. The group tells him tells him not to try to speak to it, but he still hits it. Um, and then it says what something along the lines of like what's my next thing to do mistress of flame infernal infernal mistress yeah close enough right right yeah, yeah that was a good mm -hmm. good sum up uh there was a lot of walking as well did you enjoy the put Callum where everyone was like right cool crumber has one level of exhaustion what will we do we'll all rest in the place that gives you exhaustion. Oh yeah, that, that, was, that was fun. Also, I did not appreciate you trying to get me naked again by putting my cloth around Ruya's like leg or something, so we didn't lose it. <laughs> like no. <laughs> oh, the thread path. That was so you didn't get yep. lost. More than you did. <laughs> yeah. I, I never get lost. A sorcerer <sighs> arrives precisely when he means to. I mean that. That's between. You. Never mind. Um, the Citadel would say otherwise. Was it? Old man Jet, who just wanders the halls, and then oh, he was amazing. Yeah, just talks about the architecture that nobody's even sure. He's like, but how do you even know this, mate? <laughs> so clearly, it's just BS. He's made it up in his head and he's gone delusional. <laughs> I, I mean, whatever keeps him happy, right? Yeah, whatever puts his non-existent boat. He may have a boat. He bet he doesn't. <laughs> bet he lost it. <laughs> it's in a corridor somewhere. <laughs> Behind a door that no longer exists, it just got bricked up. <laughs> yeah, probably. Uh, yeah, so I would say that's pretty much what happened last time. Is you travelled from Horizon for about a, what eight days or something? It was eight nine days, and then I uh, spotted some weird lights in the woods. Went through the dire wood, seen some familiar cultist men's and men's folks, and then absolutely annihilated them. Quite frankly. You did really, really well at that part of the combat. Um, oh, yeah. It was very nice to see uh, Crumbar's feet come into play. Um, <laughs> obviously only at half speed, of course. Um, oh, yeah, Crumbar ice two dudes. Yeah, it was very... very kind of awesome. I like... I like. I think <laughs> the mere limitations of the game economy stopped Crumbar. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, maybe that's what I need to do in the future, Scott. Maybe just half your speed to double your efforts. <laughs> Weird. Please don't. I won't. That's fine. It, 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 it doesn't work in real life, so I don't imagine it will here. Yeah. Well, we'll see what happens. However, let's go discuss goals. What's our goal? <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy the goal. Uh, but it's not going to be that because that's not a thing. So, whoever typed "get into the Frenchman's hut" can remove that. <laughs> <laughs> the, like, like the, Ryan, do you really, really need to ask who typed it? Uh, no, because I have the edit log. But at the same time, um, <laughs> right, I'm going to turn this over to you guys as a party to discuss. Um, so, See, this is they aren't infernal so we can speak to this dude <laughs> I mean find out why you think Arya is this mistress of the flame lady 
Um, like all I keep thinking about is the the fire bitch from Game of Thrones. <laughs> Melisandre. Melisandre, yeah. Is that yeah? That was it. The one that looks like my Discord picture. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. But no, I was I, I was like so I was trying to remember her name there. Um, yeah, uh, I kind of want to know who who a who she is and b if Arya is really her. If that makes sense. Right. I mean, an interesting goal, but there is a big fiery hellhole right in front of us that needs to be closed. Yeah, but yeah. <laughs> if we find out who this mistress of the flame person is, maybe she can close it. Or is. Um, I mean, I don't know. I've never really closed a big gaping fiery hole before, so. Have you tried pouring water on it? <laughs> um. Did we try pouring water on it? No, wait, no, we tried pouring water on the flame guy. But you want flame? He was just red with armor and heated from the fire. Mm -hmm. um, no, we had the feeling that he's made of flame. That there's not actually a face in it. Oh, it's just red. To the armor, and it's just like. Yeah, let's see if we can find the, the art form, because there. there is art of him. Let me just share him again. Copy. I do not remember a face. Yeah. Or even a skull. There you go, that should be it. Yeah, it's just like... It just looks like red, red energy. Red mist. Mm. Like super Saiyan yeah, God energy. Yeah, it just made of fire. <laughs> um... But yeah, I'm open to suggestions. I mean, well, we've cleared the area around... Well, you guys cleared the area around mm. the hellhole. Yeah. I don't know what this big guy's doing, whether he's on our side or not now. That's an area thing. Um, but maybe we gained an ally, maybe? is he? Are we still in combat with him? Do we know? Well, well he's waiting for my orders. I mean, you can yeah, just tell him to shut it, and then boom, done. And then we yeah, can but I, I don't him. speak in Fergal. Yeah, so, so currently only Crumbar, who is half dead, knows yeah, what it said. And, yeah. and uh, also... Can we bear in mind that right now Crumbar is confused as hell? Because what has basically happened is this thing has been attacking him and Adrian's been healing me. <laughs> right? Then yeah. I've literally just found out that in my head this thing has been attacking me under her orders. So I'm like, right, so you're getting this thing to no, attack no, he me seems but to also be awaiting heal me. orders. As if he's not been given orders yet. Do I do I need to point out the uh, <laughs> the not me point to him and the thing attack me again? I think just no, get it's our fine. My first action when we start playing properly will be to literally like bodily shove myself between him and you. So it's fine. Oh, oh, oh is that what you think is gonna? Yeah. Or you could I... tell Kumba to say something to it, and then Kumba well, could say your mistress. Well, said yeah, it. but how? Does how will the thing know that Crumbar said what I told him? It doesn't need to be very smart. I keep making very simple gestures to be like, "Hey, you, no, no, he's good, he's okay, you know, not him." Um, but uh, it doesn't seem to understand. So I think the only way it will understand is if I do something that is very, uh, you know, like like not that uh, not a grand gesture, but like some sort of something like. Visual. Yeah, like ritually sacrifice shows... Crumbar. <laughs> yeah, see, it shows that this, 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 this all relies on the f you thinking that Crumbar still trusts you. <laughs> well, I, I'm I hoping he won't try to decapitate me as I shove myself between him and that thing. Essentially showing him my back. Just mm -hmm. that's what, If Arya doesn't manage to uh, get it to understand or what she's meaning, you're dead. Yeah, One way or the other. I, 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 am, I am not lying. I have literally sat all week <laughs> and thought about how the hell I'm going to play this out. I'm pretty sure my work has suffered over my, my sheer panic <laughs> over what to do. <laughs> it's like, like my in and out tree is just like the entry is just. I love the idea that like on a wall you flip like the poster over and it's all those like little pins with all the string on them between it, and then in the middle it's just Crumbar is doomed. 
<laughs> or like this uh, mistress of the flame with a big question mark on it. <laughs> All roads lead to here. That one road we walked here. Um, right, so what's the wording of the particle? Grandma not get fucked. <laughs> That's very vague. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not touching that one. So if people could... Flash is yeah. very specific in some ways. It just depends how you read it. Yeah, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> right, well, let's go down it, right? So from, how about that? <laughs> from Eric's point of view, what is Eric's focus now, based on what you have witnessed? Well... <laughs> Well, I, I imagined I was still tied up to that rope um, reach put around me, and I'm like tied to a rope, not being able to see anywhere. So. No, but you're still trying to chase Roya with that thread. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> no, you'll you'll be nearish by. You would have been narratively excused because you weren't here last time. So yeah. You'll just be nearby. Hey, my voice won't hear uh, here. <laughs> <laughs> um, so there's that. So what's your focus if you had to work it as a goal close the help hole right okay so nothing to These do with people. the kind of weird night of hell thing i mean ari's pet she's got another one cool <laughs> imagine it was it ruya from the future <laughs> um, <Nani. laughs> um i did enjoy the session title last time with infernal affairs couldn't like lie still mm. love it um, right, what about yourself, Arya? What's your goal? Mm, well, I think Arya's only goal in the near-ish future would be to be reunited with her bird. Like, <laughs> I, I, like, like I said, like she doesn't really care much about a lot of things. Now, keep in mind She's when like I'm asking about goals. With the mission, because this is the mission. So, keep in mind when I'm asking about goals. I mean. The answer I expect is the thing you do in the game immediately. So, if your goal is go reunite yourself with Ruga, I assume you would just yeah disengage okay. from the fight, in, head through the woods, in, and go in home. This, okay, in this case, it would probably be something like you know finding a way to calm down this being and ensuring the party doesn't get burned to it. Crisp big by it, just saying. I mean, I don't think it's burnt anyone yet. There's only so much I can. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Like, there's only so much healing that I have left, and if it starts like using the fact that it's like you know, hella warm, mm. um, quite literally, mm. um, hella warm. Then, yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, then, then that might make things you know, and and you know, life incompatible with with these sort of also oh, random shout out to a character called Hella human. 13,000 years later <laughs> 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 so um yeah okay what about yourself then crumbar what's crumbar's goal oh no that <laughs> murderate not mediator that's the, the word I was thinking. oh mediator yes not murderate yeah. yes <laughs> not die would be a good one but then when do you get that XP, right? That's exactly <laughs> right. Um, and also it's going to be a very tough one to accomplish. Yeah, because you die. <laughs> and then you don't get XP, I guess. Yeah. So so right now... Sorry, let me just go to my mind map that I've got up here. Uh, so right now, I want to find out the truth from Aria, basically, see see who this mistress of the flame woman is, okay. and also, and I... then and then try and defuse the situation, whether that's by peaceful negotiation or hammer swinging. So we're we just summarizing all of this into truth bomb. <laughs> yeah, truth bomb, basically. Okay. Um, okay. Get a better understanding of. Yeah, basically, mm. find out who the mistress of the flame woman is, there you go. and then that, 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 yeah, good enough. And Kitty, I think we should figure out this mistress of the flame stuff, but we do also need to like close the hell hole that's open. So, yeah, it's a difficult one. Mm -hmm. Um, 
I mean, we're going to end up doing both. Yeah, I'm really hoping they'll turn out to be kind of one in the same. Yeah. Well, it's like the word and for the goals. Yeah, how do you use plan on closing the hellhole, I guess, is what you need to think about as well. Because it's all well and good saying, okay, let's have a goal. Let's do this. Let's make a jam sandwich. And you realise you don't have jam or a sandwich or a knife or bread. And you think... Or, or butter. I've got butter. Oh, there is. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, we got one thing, right. I've got jam. <laughs> there we go. See? The, the goal's coming together. But... Jam sandwich time. Yes. What about yourself, Reach? What about... Will it reach his uh, focus? Yeah, uh, to be honest, we won't be able to close this hellhole. I'm pretty sure about that. This magic will be above us. So, but we can tell Princess Blah Blah to mm -hmm. go into it. Just do it, yeah. Unless yeah, you specifically mean right. Princess Blah Blah from your background. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but so, let's find out who this uh, Lady of the Flame is. Oh. Mm. So, and it sounds like the most kind of overlapping goal is investigate that part of the yeah the revelation unless there was any more you were looking to investigate theirs too no not investigate uh, is the better wording for it as well That's... so who wants to type up the party goal and then we'll get started get into the frenchman's house <laughs> I mean, I feel like we've lost sight of the goal here, but that's fine. <laughs> it's like, yes, investigate Mr. Flame. Everyone agreed? Yes, cool. Into the Frenchman's house we go. <laughs> 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 Glad we all agree. Okay, bye guys. <laughs> Immediate left turn. Um, right, I don't see this goal being written yet by anyone, though, so, I mean, come on, guys. This is. Words are not my forte. No, that's why you don't play a wizard. I'm a crumbar, that's all I'm gonna say. Yep, I will apply crumbar to the the problem and hope it resolves itself. <laughs> um hey. or processors. Hmm. Uh, Excels, what you got? Uh investigate what this thing is. Uh Yes, Glug. I like Glug. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense, by the way. Caveat. Okay. Yeah, it's caveat. Cause it makes it look like a cool handwritten sheet, obviously. Everybody loves handwritten fonts. Which is <laughs> <laughs> why I take everything. <laughs> <laughs> this is immersion stew. It's immersion. <laughs> <laughs> um, right. Okay. So, are you happy with the wording? Investigate what the mistress of the flame is. Yeah. Yep, yep. I think it should be who the mistress. Okay. What do other people think about that? Because mm. what if it's not a who? What if it's just a title? I bet what it's not a who. who? Yeah, but a title would need to belong to who, so... About who and or what? Apparently... Ah. have a twin somewhere, just saying. Apparently the spear doesn't... Uh, uh, yeah. It belongs to a what, according to the king. <laughs> mm. The Black Fang spear, yeah. Yeah, he was definitely adamant that it was a thing. <laughs> yeah. Not, not an Eremos boy. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, if I'm going to start coughing, I'm just going to pull my mic out, guys. Please so don't not... pull the mic out. Oh god, it'll sound horrible. It'll be worse than the coughing. Just put your hand <laughs> over your mouth and cough. It's easier. <laughs> um, I don't know if I can do that, Ryan. I wasn't brought up in the high society. Born in the barn. <laughs> Isn't that for leaving doors open, though? Like, Even though I mean, barns have very big doors. Same sentiment. Sure. Uh, right, so investigate what and or who the mistress of the flame is. That our new goal? Yeah, Whee! let's roll with that. Can't roll so. uh, that's slightly bugging me. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I thought uh, it was a young person thing, actually. Uh, you have everything all lowercase as well, but apparently not a noise. Uh, okay. <laughs> Maybe certain young people. Um, yeah. Yeah, that sounds good to me. That's I ain't young no more. 
Oh wow, here we go, the youngest, oh, in, the youngest in the channel, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm old, what does that make you guys? Better. Oof. Better. Older. So, uh, it makes us, better. It makes us your elders and you should respect us. <laughs> We're higher level than you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll kick your ass. Yeah, it just means I can branch off more. I've got a path to choose, you guys are like, limited. Uh, nah, that must be it. Um, wow. So, I'll have you know, Oprah Winfrey didn't start her <laughs> career till later in life. Jake was oh. in her 30s, I think, when she started Harry Potter. And if uh, Oprah Winfrey <laughs> and uh, J.K. Rowling are listening, you are welcome to guest star, if you wish. Um, <laughs> that would be definitely interesting. Right, let's. Oh. Life doesn't start till you reach 30. Let's put it that life, way. Life doesn't start till you're Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Uh... Oh, it's black. Oh, Lord. I forgot we're in a dark forest. Oh, yeah, we're right. So, <laughs> let me just go acquire. Oh, yeah, what's the initiative? Eric. That's where, where did Eric go? Why, <laughs> why is he hiding? That's a good point. I like how Eric's just going to, like, <laughs> up here out of nowhere. It's just like, I was sitting on the table the whole time. I think I jokingly said something like he got himself caught in like branches or some shit. Um, oh no, my robes! Not again! Um, oh, see, and this is how you end up naked again. <laughs> to be honest, the whole campaign's secretly called Eric's New Clothes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I was trapped as a llama once. <laughs> not gonna lie, I'll run that campaign for you, Callum, if you want to play that, because that would be hilarious. And there's back my coffee out. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, is that your real backstory? Like, you used to be a llama, and that's how you got into this deal with us. Yeah, it's woman? backwards though. Like, the evil llama sorceress was trying to turn him into like you know a human, blah blah blah, or poison him. One of the two, we're not sure what. He ended up a human, you know. Oh man, your parents are totally llamas somewhere. But you don't know it because your mind got wiped. <gasps> oh, I mean, I'm, I'm amazing. And the evil person that turned me. What's the blue dragon? Bum, bum, bum. I think we've got some of you guys. Yep, I just have that. Um, right. uh, gold. It's the Kronk gif when he's looking at like, <laughs> the board going, I mean, it doesn't actually make any sense. <laughs> 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 right, anyway, here we are on the map. Eric, you're on the map. In the darkness. Yes, because Hello, it's dark. Darkness, my old friend. Um. How close? Where do I actually want to put you? Roll a d20 for me. Put, put them in the trees. <laughs> I'm in the trees. 17. That's pretty good. That's my, my one high roll for the day. You can be... Here... You want? You can be there. Oof. He's hiding in the tent. Uh, I need you to <laughs> click on your token and roll initiative only, Callum. Four. Oh yeah. That makes perfect sense. My commitment is a level of four. <laughs> and I believe, from what I can see on the turn tracker, that it's Crumbler's turn. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ryan. Me. Yes, you. Please don't Can... kill me. <laughs> I'm just wondering, with me being a part of Golden Order and all that nonsense, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. can I roll like history or arcana to see if I would know who this mistress of the gold flame is? Gold flame, no. What was it? <laughs> mistress of the flame. It was just mistress of the flame, wasn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can I roll one of them to see if I would know? Mm, let me think. Hmm. It would be... 
What would it be? Hmm. Yeah, you can roll history or arcana. You'd get slightly different answers, maybe. Hmm. It's both intelligence, isn't it? So something from Alex. I'd rather roll arcana. Sure. Um, now keep in mind. Yeah. This is your action, because you're in combat. Mm hmm. <laughs> and I'm guessing talking is an action as well. Nope. You get about six worth, six seconds worth of chatting. I want right, to question yep. action. It's only if you're trying to actually do something with the talking, like convincing someone, then it's like a persuasion check. Right, okay. Boop. Like convince them not to kill you. Shit. <laughs> that was not what I wanted. So. Um, let's see. There are lots of, obviously, books in the library at the the Golden Citadel. You obviously studied to some degree in the Golden Citadel. Whether or not you paid attention is irrelevant, but some of them had pictures in them. <laughs> and lots of them had females that were naked, wreathed in flames. So, you remember naked ladies on fire. <laughs> Right, on my sex tape. Uh, right. I love the idea that this, the title is You Remember. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously he was so drunk. <laughs> um, but yeah, so you remember back to the only time you really wanted to pay attention learning anything about demons um, was sexy naked fire ladies. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's what you get. But you get a move and a bonus action. And however long, whatever that concentration spell lasts for. How long does it last? I think it's like a million rounds. Yeah, yeah something like that. But I want the answer though. Adrian, just remember I love you. Oh god, what are you going to do? So... I mean, I fully expect you to hide behind me now, but just saying. After... Here is what my thought process. So is it Hunter's Mark? Is that what you've got on? Yeah, it's never... Hunter's Mark. Right, cool. Hunter's Mark. Oh yeah, sorry, shit, I didn't even... Because there was no answer to that question. Yeah, sorry mate, um, my, my head was... Uh, where are we? Getting okay, smacked up the head, aren't I? Duration up to an hour. Ah, that's fine, that's why we weren't tracking it. <laughs> <clears throat> so, here's how it's played out in my head. Ow. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Thoughts. Mm. I'm having one of those things, a headache with pictures. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> Is it wreathed in flames? Uh, soon will be. So, I've interpreted this thing to be turning around to Arya and being like, Yo, I am under your command. And then he's mentioned Mistress of the Flame. And I'm like, oh snap, who is this bitch? Because already one member of the party is not who they've said they are. Oh, and don't know who you're on about. <laughs> I know, right? Who could yeah, that possibly Eric. be? What? I don't even know who I am. <laughs> <laughs> so one member of the party is already somebody else. And... Well, we've been attacking this thing, or more importantly, well, <laughs> well, this thing is. Don't been ask attacking. me why she's appeared. <laughs> I, I, I was, I was gonna say, I'm like, um, hi. Okay. So she just came to interject. Apparently, she's a shortcut on my keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hello, Justoria. Um, Please help us. <laughs> I mean, of all the logical shortcuts to have, that is definitely one of the better ones. <laughs> my, my cheat but, sheet to get to, you know, Archmage Justoria. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> cool. Um, yeah. So while this, thi while we've been fighting this thing, more so while this thing has been pummeling the crap out of me, Ari has also been healing me. So I'm like, right, has she been doing this because she just wants me to suffer, mm -hmm. or what? 
The crumbar turns around to face Arya, holds his hammer up towards her in a threatening manner, and just says, "Explain who you are." And this, a uh, sorry, explain who you are, and then kind of like, so like, in air quotes, "Mistress of the Flame." So you go to threaten the thing that the. Now, keep in mind. Twenty bodyguards. <laughs> keep keep, no, keep so, in mind. Let, no. I am not a smart man. Right. So. So have you already? No, 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 no. That's what I was about to say. So, Crumbar, only you have heard it say yep. that to her, which you, she can't speak, <laughs> as far yep. as you're aware. <laughs> yep. So yeah. Carry on. <laughs> yeah, that's still what I'm going with because. Yep, that's all. I just wanted to make sure you were fully aware of that one step. Okay. Yeah, because again. Go some extra hit points that I can't see. Uh, <laughs> again, how do I know that she is not lying? That she can't really speak it. Mm. That's a fair point. Hey, at least I haven't just straight up rode for an attack on her. Come on. I'm sure, you're out of actions for that, but yeah. But yeah, on that question, I'll end. Interesting. Look whose turn it is next. Mm. Yeah. Well then. Well, let's put it this way. I probably am not very afraid of you. Even <laughs> like that. Just saying. Because I know the rest won't let you, you know, actually kill me. You just randomly turn around me and kill me. Um, so... I'm gonna be like, what are you on about? What mistress? What flame? What? And I, I, I kind of try to like, like I put my hand up to like almost like you know how when you somebody has their hand up, you kind of put their hand your hand at their elbow mm. and you like put pressure like at the, you know, I was about to say at the wrist of their elbow and I'm like, no, that's wrong. <laughs> we know, we know what you mean though, the joint of your elbow, yeah. Yeah, 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 to like, like lower his hand. I'm like, what the heck? What are you on about? Mm. Can I reply to that? Mm -hmm. This thing seems to be under your control. And then you've pretty much got what? about a response worth of um, sentence, and that's. Then I'm going to ask what you're going to be doing. <laughs> and also, Rich does have a my point. My control? <laughs> How could it be my control? I don't have no idea what it is or where it's coming from or what's been mumbling about. So, at that point, Crumbar, you can take on board what she said. Okay, mm -hmm. but that's it. Arya, I need you to yeah. tell me what you're doing with the rest of your turn, though. Um. Because you can have about six so... seconds worth of banter with each other, but that's about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no. I'm just thinking. Like, obviously, I, I, I raise my hand to like kind of put hand my hand on like the bend of his elbow and be like, you know, you know, stopping an idiot sort of thing. Put that <laughs> you might hit yourself with it. Um, but and <laughs> yeah, that's that's kind of what I I'd, I'd, I'd be doing and. Yeah, you still got your entire know, turn to take if you want, so... You still got an action, um, a bonus action, you still got well, movement. Well, I would not know what they've been talking, right? So I would Correct. probably still see him with his health being low, so I could just use one of my healing spells at level 1, not level 2, on him and be like, let me patch you up a bit more, sort of thing. And confuse me even more. Oh yeah. <laughs> we all know oh, our yeah, healing word is suffer. <laughs> 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 Yeah, go for you it. You will live to suffer more. <laughs> yep, so. I'll do that in a second, but yeah. Also, I'm not 100% still on the actual wild shape rules, but maybe I think that is actually a legit thing she could do. I'm just looking at the elephant stats just now. <laughs> <laughs> Get five health. What I was checking for is if they have a swim speed, because then she couldn't do it. But um, <laughs> they do not, so I was like, hmm. And weirdly, they're challenge rating 4 and user level 4, so I think maybe she could. <laughs> <laughs> also, don't fuck with elephants, right? Oof. Nah, you don't. <laughs> One elephant so... is a match for you as a party right now. 
<laughs> yeah, can we Damn. not elephant? <laughs> there you go, so you get five five healths. Yay, I've already had it. I know. I just want to say it for the, the wonderful folks at home. Um Right, okay. Uh, anything else with your turn? Mark off a heal a spelly slot thing and then Is that you, my dear? Did. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, yep, this thing stands, looks kind of confused. Um, as soon as Crumbar like raises his hammer up to you, the thing goes and like kind of motions one step forward, and then um, it repeats the orders that obviously Crumbar can hear, which is um, "Mistress of the Flame, what are your orders?" And it's clutching its sword. So no attack or anything like that. Has Crumbar got time to translate that? I mean, would you, Crumbar, or are you still confused? What's happening? What's in Crumbar's I'm head? I'm, I'm, I'm literally trying to think. You're going to be concussed soon. That so she's like at, you know, so basically I So you've said, what's all this Mistress of the Flame stuff? After mm. barking in this infernal hell tongue to this creature she can't understand. Mm. Whether or not Crumbar knows that or not, again, irrelevant. She's went, what are you talking about? Heal yourself you mad fool. And then touched your elbow. Possibly during the healing process. Um, as you get patched up. And then this thing's just been like, so what are your orders, mistress? Hello, mistress. Hey, listen. Hey. Um, oh. But it did look defensive <laughs> when you obviously raised your hammer up to her. Um, angrily. So, yeah, it's up to you if you would verbalize anything. If not, we're moving on. Hmm. This thing asks you for your orders. Mm. Reach. So is that him like going around and all, all this thing does listen to your orders or Yeah, he says that to you. Mm, oh yeah, sorry, oh, cool. yeah, I've said that. I'm 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 still staring at you even though just I'm now confused and my head hurts. <laughs> Didn't possibly from things. getting confused, possibly from getting my head caved in. Who knows? Need a bit of colour, me. <laughs> <laughs> it's um, which is go? It's me. Right. Yeah, yes. Uh, I didn't see. Cromba just translate for that. It's, looks as. Yeah, I see. Uh, Cromba, yeah, just translate what the flaming monster saying, flaming knight saying. That's. And I'm not going to do anything else. Uh, should I prepare? You tell me. Should you? Uh, well, I'll prepare to fire a raiding bolt at the Flaming Knight uh, if he attacks either Arya or Crumbar, right? It would need to be if he makes an attack against the party, like as a singular. It can't be yeah, an, I, an either or, if that makes sense. Uh, yeah. Exactly. So if he uh, makes an attack you'll move in, regardless of who the target is. Assuming there's not an enemy, or like some random frog or something. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. It, it's just, reaction triggers cannot have a, like, options. Yeah, perfect. That's good. That works, yeah, yep, right, works for cool. me, yep. yep. Um, can I, no can I get your response? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so he's basically said, just translate. Mm -hmm. Yes. And then he's like held out his fist, iron fist style. It starts to glow as he holds it, but then mm -hmm. still isn't moving because you haven't really seen him. Depends how much attention Crumbar's been paying to the rest of the party, though. But like, obviously, him and Kitty haven't really been fighting this um, <laughs> Yeah. I mean, obviously, I've, I've I've heard what he said, but my gaze is still fixed on Arya. Mm -hmm. um, so I just shout over. Uh, this thing is asking Arya for instructions and calls her the Mistress of the Flame. Mm -hmm. I probably have enough time to say, Arya, give him safe instructions, please. <laughs> <laughs> Arya can't even give him instructions. Yeah. <laughs> and overhead. Eric. 
Right, and uh, some of some of these lights, so I can see the place. I mean, you can see the place, right? Yeah, so I can. Right, what do I say? <laughs> Time to summon these lights, so I can see the place. I mean, there's there's a fire source right next to you. Two uh, at least. I can't there. see the distance between me and Arya. Really? That's interesting. Yes. No, that's weird. Is well, that because be you're behind a tent? No. Let me just check that. <laughs> it's not a straight line, it's a curve, is it? Oh, that is interesting. Maybe that's because there is no light source where they're standing. Yes. Because we've yeah. destroyed them. Huh. Destroyed. You inconsiderate people. I've got that's maybe a bit. I was going to say, I have viewed the map from his point of view, he is mostly correct. <laughs> I can see a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Where's my baubles? <laughs> now I can see. I can see. I can fight. I use my action to summon Denton Baubles. <laughs> there we go. Sort it. Uh, yeah, I'm done. I, lo I love that you've just kind of showed up being like, oh, so what's going on here then? You see <laughs> these Denton Baubles appearing as I'm stood behind reaching. Uh, yeah, it's like little inside. storm clouds just all appear in between you guys, like, wait, what? And you start to see things in, like, colour. <laughs> uh, did you mean to roll that? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I was, hey, I literally you just, got a sneak attack? I was moving it away from uh, the other the other screen that I was on. It's just where I clicked was the the long sword. It's a good attack though, so he's probably glad I wasted that. Yep. <laughs> I mean, even with advantage or disadvantage, that would fit me. That's why you need to get yourself some uh, better clothes. I mean, I knew better naked. <laughs> You might be in this specific game. Maybe. <laughs> oh. <laughs> not see me, so can't judge. I mean, Eric is magic. <laughs> yeah, you don't need an armor, it's fine. So, moving up there, <laughs> walking out of the darkness, making these little storm clouds, being edgy as fuck. Hey, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Sup. Your homeboy has arrived. Edgelord has returned. Oh, <laughs> I feel like the blue cloak's misleading now, isn't it, though? Can we... Oh, that's true. You can give me the uh, that little red robe thing. That, that picture. I don't know if I still have that somewhere. That was like a random Google search if I find it again. <laughs> it's in the chat. It if you be. scroll up, I think. Yeah, I need to teach you guys how to make tokens. That's what I need to do to save me having to do it. Uh, give me a second, I'll see if I can actually get this uh, even tinted. So, you doing anything else? So that was what your dancing lights is. What, a cantrip, right? So. Yeah, it's cantrip. And damn, that guy is so cool. <laughs> I might not be worthy of his suaveness. Mm. Like, damn. Yeah. He looks like he should be on a deck of cards. <laughs> Is this also what you learned in the Golden Order? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Love it. Yeah, for some reason this has been a bit weird. Let's see, does this work? This might tint the token. There we go. Good enough. <laughs> I have overcome with rage! <laughs> um, right, what else you did? That's it. Everything? Okay. I mean, I can Good dance speech. my lights around. You could also say something. I'm just gonna be like, okay, I'm gonna say something. What the fuck's that? 
<laughs> and then I guess on that note we go round to Kitty uh, well what's going on over there guys what's happening she's as confused as me I think we all just sort of stood around like are we fine shall we put these away what are you doing <laughs> Is it a tickle patty? It's a, it's the meme of that like monkey thing where it's like like posing with its arms sort of out like what? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what's happening? I don't know what's going on. Nobody tells me nothing. Yeah, right. Nobody tells me nothing. I mean, pretty much I have nothing to contribute because I don't know what's going on. <laughs> So I guess that ends my turn, really. Yeah, if you wanted to. You could say something yeah. to the grander scheme of things, or is that like what you were voicing aimed at someone specific? That's pretty much what I was voicing, just like shouting to them too, like, what's going on? So is it aimed at anyone specific though, or just just like, screaming to the void? Uh, I guess Krumba, seeing as... Would we have maybe heard the thing crackle talking and realised mm -hmm. it was in... You, what's it in you, you could assume that, yeah. Yeah, it's gonna, since we know Crumbar speaks it, it's like, yo, what's he saying? Mm -hmm. But then he did shout at us that, oh, uh, I don't know. So, Just... he did tell you what it said. He, he mentioned yeah. that it's calling her the Mistress of the Flame and asking her for orders, and side-eyeing her really, really intensely. Mm. Does anyone know what the Mistress of the Flame is? Not a clue, yeah. Cool beans. <laughs> I, guess I guess that ends my turn. Other than they're winning the way out of this mess, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Crumba. <laughs> he could be muted. No. Nope. Yes, no. Mm -hmm. Sorry, no, I've been muting it when I've been having to call. Um. This is seriously hard. I'm having to think. I don't like it. I would prefer just swinging a hammer. I mean, it's an action you can take. Or well, think, or swing the hammer. <laughs> Both. One or the other. <laughs> 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 Until he gets multi-attack. <laughs> it's ask uh, again, looking at Arya. It's yeah. asking you for orders. Well, I don't speak its language. What am I supposed to tell it? What do you want to tell it? Stand down! That's clear. Um, say... So I... Say to Arya... Tell it this then, and then I say how to say stand down in Infernal. Okay. So, roll performance, Crumber. Oh shit. Remember it's at disadvantage. Just like oh, the shit. Arcana should have been, but whatever. <laughs> oh shit, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Um I'd hmm. like to use this can I use the seven out of that? Sadly we need to pick <laughs> the lowest one. <laughs> oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> use the seven then. Yeah, okay. Um right. Are ya? So you get told a bunch of crackling log sounds. Um, would you like to roll performance if you want to see it, unless you don't want to see it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, we're on to your turn, so give us a wee performance check. Don't think you're at disadvantage. I think it was just, um, or is it? No. Uh, is it just you, or is it other people? I think it's just me that's no, the same level to. I think it's most of us, isn't it? I was going to say, I think it might be actually. Let me go get the, the exhaustion thingy. I thought I rolled and I passed. Uh, that would be on your sheet. Does I've it... got a level 1 exhaustion, I know that. But... You might not have, are you? Yeah. Is it on your sheet somewhere? One sec. And yeah, it's level 1 has the disadvantage on the ability checks. Okay, I wrote down what it was, but yeah, okay, disadvantage on ability. I'll, I'll just roll again then and we'll get the smaller one. 
No, get a bigger one. Could be. Because then we use the 12. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. So, yeah, you crackle what you assume is stand down. Let me roll. Did that work? Will it work? It did work. Cool. So, are you doing anything else with your uh, turn? Are you with your bonus action or your move? Um, I'm gonna like try to move so that I'm kind of like standing with Crumbar at my back and like in front of the creature. I can't quite like. Yeah, it'd only be if Crumbar had uh, moved. Uh, it would only have yeah, been well, if he'd moved. Well, uh, well, okay. I uh, don't see that. Yeah. Granted, it's fine. you can change my mind here, Scott, but I just feel like you wouldn't have moved away from it or her. So. Oh, no, no. Yeah. Um, but I can understand what she's wanting to kind of be like in between. Like, like, if I was there. Well, maybe, kinda... like, raise my hands in the, like, you know, universal symbol of stop. You know, like, when mm. you just raise your hands, palms up, and, like, you know, like, I'll be like, stand down and, like, raise my tell palms. The, tell, the, like... tell the fuck out, bro. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. uh, anything with, like, your bonus action or that, or just... No, I think we're fine for now, I think. Okay. As in, I don't think of anything else that I could be doing or should be doing right That's now, fine. so... Yeah. yeah. Um, how long does your bear last? Was it... So many rounds? I think it was... Was it ten rounds? Find that out for me if you can. It's like Spirit Totem, and it should say how many rounds or minutes. I don't think like anyone's still benefiting from it, or Strength checks. Yeah, it's like me that still has it. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's more just about how many rounds it's been, that's all. Yeah. But while Arr. you're checking for that, that's okay. I'm gonna carry on. So, this thing looks between the two of you. I am. Um, and then nods its head once to you, are you? Its um, sword oh, okay. kind of like disappears in that kind of flamey, metallic -y, kind of black, kind of obsidian colour thing. Um, and then it slowly just kneels in front of you, and puts both its hands out and kind of takes your bow from you. It starts uh, barking in what sounds like infernal, but Crumber, you're not actually understanding it. Mm. Like, wait, so it took it took my bow. Yep, it's holding it. It's not actually removed it from your grip. Yeah, yeah. It's just also now holding it as it's kneeling in front of you, and it's mumbling sure. in a infernal. Bloody hell. Um, Crumber, the equivalent would be like somebody just babbling nonsense to you. Okay. Basically, like speaking to a drunkard. Yeah. Like, yeah, I know what you're totally just saying. Like from across the road. Um, yeah. Glasgow singing. Yeah. yeah. Is, is, is <laughs> any, anyone in Glasgow. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, the entire suit of armour catches fire. And it just keeps on saying what it's saying. And all the flame seems to travel all over the kind of metallic armour, all down the, you know, arms into the bow. And then all the pieces of armor like fall to the ground and turn to ash. Oh. And your bow is on fire. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Um. Painful fire. I, can I like let let go of it? Because I'd rather not have a bow than be on fire. You know. Um. Sure. Yeah. It falls to the ground. Since it hits the ground, the flames stop. Looks like your bow. Okay. Mm -hmm. So reach. It didn't attack anyone. <laughs> no. So right. What would you like to do with your turn? <laughs> I. <sighs> I'm tempted just to sit down and have a watch here. Uh, what do I? Uh... Arya, can you close your character sheet for me? Oh. And just let me know once you've closed it. If you're responding, I cannot hear you. Okay. 
Okay, done. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Cool. I'll let you know when you can open it again. Where exactly is it, by the way? What do you mean? Flamey. Okay. So, as I uh, described, it kneeled down yes. and then once all the fire passed to the bow, it all fell to the ground clattering and then turned to ash and blew away. I'm pretty the sure it's in, in our bow. Right, okay. Nope, the bow was in our hands burning. She dropped it, it fell to the ground, it stopped burning, it's still in the ground. I think oh, Arya has gained a summon. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I think so as well. I'll pass up my turn at the moment. And yeah, I'd pick up that bow again, Arya. Yeah. But... I mean, that's the thing. Yeah. Like, the bo did the bow actually damage you? Nope. Well, no, I'm just a web in real life when it comes to fire, so it kind of translated to the character as well, sorry. <laughs> but fire is fun. It makes pizza. Fire is fun! Now let other people play with it and I will be at a nice safe distance. <laughs> Pyrophobe here, honestly. Not fun. Sure, mistress of the... <laughs> I know, that's why it's ironic. Sounds like the hound from Game of Thrones. Mm-hmm. I'm just more thinking about this. One second, guys. Somebody was in my door. I think maybe my She's flatmate fine. forgot her keys or something. Okay. So, as um, she is caught in awe, what is everybody else to it? So, reach. Yeah, end my turn. I just said pick up your bow, but other than that, nothing else to do. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Right, in theory. In theory, that works, but we'll find out. Maybe that works. We'll find out if it works. It's fine. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Who's next then? Eric? Ooh. Hmm. We're going to stroll up to the edge here. And I'm going to ping a rare frost at the big flame wall. Because, you know, shooting stuff with magic has helped me many times in the past. This is very true in some ways. Hey, uh, yeah. You hit the big wall of fire. Does it take damage? Can I roll damage? Roll damage, roll, yeah. Was he hit by a weak beam? And no idea if it even made impact or not, or if it just melted before it hit the fire. <laughs> yeah. Just gonna shrug and turn around and go, what do we do? <laughs> mm -hmm. And. Did you? Well, did not see that coming. Um... I mean, has Aya picked up the bow again yet? No, oh, yeah. I'm having her dramatically stare at it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I guess inspect the bow. Like I just go over to it and like prod it a bit. I guess. <laughs> yeah. I love how even though you're an elf, you're still a cat. <laughs> <laughs> I like use my uh, my rapier and just like poke it. Is it like on? Is it like sizzling or does it look just like a normal bow again? I mean, you could always roll uh, investigate. Eh. I mean, somebody dropped the bow here. Yep. Cool. It's also pretty sure. Do you? I think you made your roll as well. You don't have exhaustion, right? Or did you have exhaustion too? Because that'd be it. Uh, I think I did have exhaustion because I wrote it down somewhere. 
Because then we had it and then got rid of it and then got it again. So. Okay. Well, either way, somebody's yeah. dropped a bow here. Yeah. I feel like there is very little else that could happen besides a one, and even with that, there's only so ridiculous it can get looking at a bow. Except somehow it shoots <laughs> an arrow at you. <laughs> 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 um. Yeah. The bow's become sentient. Are you, do you end up picking the bow back up, or are you leaving it there, or what's your response? Because we did skip ahead from you just because you went away. I'll I'll pick it up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Feel free to go read your character sheet now. I just did, and I'm confused. Mm -hmm. Do you see it? Yeah, I just don't know what it means. <laughs> Can you put it in chat? Forest fire! Bracket. Bow. Close back. You've got an enchanted to, bow, then. Yeah, yeah. If you need to light a campfire, I wouldn't use that. <laughs> 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 I think your bow does flame damage now. I I think it, it's kind of weird to think that I I think I'll be a bit afraid to use the bow because I might expect the random that creature to <laughs> pop out of it. So see when you spend yeah. air quote an hour attuning to this thing, you will instinctively know okay. all of the text. Oh, cool. Okay, yeah. Right. At some point, when we have yep. time, I'll do that. Yep. Cool, cool, cool. So that's a thing. So you will learn it, and it will like reveal its name to you in such in such that hour, etc., etc. Blah blah blah. So on and so forth. Awesome. Yeah. So, hmm. I mean, who knows what you even said to it though, right? <laughs> when you re replied back, like my mother used to frequent here <laughs> in Infernal. <laughs> <laughs> You're not a smell of elderberry. Ah, <laughs> should have called the boy ah, elderberry. <laughs> quite nice. <laughs> um, right, so I think we can uh, dispense with the initiative order because it doesn't look like unless Crumbar's going to swing it, are you? I think it's Crumbar's turn to react anyway. So Crumbar, this thing's yeah. just turned like put its flamey energy into Arya's bow. The bow caught fire. She dropped the bow. The thing fell apart into its armor pieces and turned to dust. This is actually, in all honesty, the hardest situation you've put me in so far. You're welcome. Wait till the Frenchman's house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I walked in. Um, That's one way, I guess. <laughs> so you've kind of, you've kind of, the fact that Arya picked the bow up kind of is <laughs> done me because my plan was I was always going to shove her out of the way and then... It's kind of why I made her head. react first before you, weirdly. It's <laughs> yeah. Funny, Actually, funny. mostly it's because she runs away and she would have had time to react before anyway, so... Uh, initiative order did matter once. But yeah, what does Crumbar do to react? He's, he sees Arya holding her bow. Like normal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seriously thinking. Uh, what's the best? Also, oh, I yeah. assume you let your uh, hunter of mark drop because that's that's long gone. Oh yeah. Um. <laughs> to be fair, you've been thinking that entire time. So, and you managed to hold concentration through a lot of damage. I did. <laughs> Which is kind of awesome. Oh, no, not that one. <laughs> um. Guys, any suggestions? Are you Shaboki? Um, I have no clue what's what's happened to it. I'll have to properly investigate and analyze what how it's been corrupted by this thing. I have a crazy idea. Shoot an arrow at the firewall. I was literally just about to say that. <laughs> Same wavelength. Same wavelength. Oh my god. Um, but again, I don't want Crumbar to be the one that said it. So. <laughs> Remember, What's you can speak dead? as a party. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <dear>. um, <laughs> I think your bear vanishes as well. Yeah. Bye, oh, yeah, bear. Yeah. oh no, how will we bear without it? I think, I think Eric vanishes as well. <laughs> <laughs> I think he goes, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I am the lord of the fire. 
Oh no, <laughs> he's on fire. Um, I think you were here, I think. <laughs> I'll just use my hammer to get out. It's fine. It's not charged. I'll charge it. <laughs> <laughs> um, can, so, can you tell me now though, I'm assuming in the eight days you took to get here, Eric, that you would have charged the hammer? Yes, I wanted to do it at the end. Well, not last session, the session before when we decided to it's, leave. It's fine, it has been eight days. You can have it fully charged. Yes. <laughs> right. Is Arya going to react to what uh, Eric said about shooting it? I'm just going to be looking at it, looking at you, looking at it, looking at you, and be like, I'm not sure that's wise just now. Well. To burn out an old fire, you must start a new fire. Like, Arya didn't start what the if fire. It just, <laughs> what if it just gets the little, the the big flame dude out of the bow and back in? Like, how do I? Imagine uh, that you fire an arrow and he just pops out of the arrow and tackles them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, that's, <laughs> the, that's what I'm expecting that's right. right now. I'm not even joking. Like, I, I don't know if the bow is a bow that's like somehow been. You know, corrupted, enchanted, whatever, because I've not had the chance to analyze it. Or if he somehow got into the bow, and every time I fire the bow, I just like fling him into the enemy. Bear in mind, I've still got a hammer pointed at your face. Probably gonna be yeah, was that was Yeah, into the enemy or into the crumber. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Stuck between a wall of fire and a crumber. See, to be fair though, crumber is probably barely holding the hammer up, really, right? Because let's face oh, it. Oh yeah. Like you actually had to do the "I am an orc and I will not die." How dare you? Like move to stay standing, and also you've been patched up, so you're probably like super amped up by by magic healing from yourself and nature, aka Arya, and then. Yeah, I mean, you've been concentrating on that spell for that, ages. That's, that's pretty much how I feel right now. <laughs> so, you are probably pretty knackered as well. Mm -hmm. You get two levels of exhaustion. That is literally you being knackered. <laughs> so, yeah. Mm. I can imagine Crumbers has enough of people shit. <laughs> so, Arya, what's your, what's your response to Eric staring at the fire, going, you should shoot your bow at it, and then Crumbar still kind of menacingly holding his hammer up to you as if you're the enemy? I'll, like, physically position myself so I'm not, like... Y you know how you're, like, moving away from somebody that's acting like an idiot, but not because you're afraid of them, but... The term is disengaging. I don't know how to put it. I guess... <laughs> <laughs> but that involves a level of, like, shit, like... <laughs> You know, like I'm really in trouble going away now, blah blah blah. It's kind of like. I keep my disengaging, just taking a guarded step away from the. Yeah, I The guess. thing you okay, think okay. is a threat. I'll, 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 I'll do that and uh, be like, guys, I don't know what this bow does. Like, I don't yeah. want to possibly start a massive fire here or something. Ar Aria, do me a favor, move your character away from me. Oh, yeah, one sec. I wanna I wanna do something. In Arya's like hesitation, can I be like doing the animation of pulling a bowstring just like shoot? Mm hmm Yeah, you're in the background just being like shoot the bow, shoot the bow. Right, okay. <laughs> As, a random D ten. <laughs> yeah, no no, I wanted to do that to decide what I was what what was gonna happen to Crumbar next. I see. So as Arya is kinda scooting away, um I, I'm obviously yelling at her, it's like, don't you dare move, and I take one step after, and I just collapse on the ground. Because <laughs> I am fur. And, like, it's that kind of way, like, if you were to look at me now, I'm just kind of lying, like, kind of lying on, like, my hands and knees, just kind of, like, stand up, and probably using, like, my hammer as kind of, like, a crutch, almost, mm -hmm. to try and get back up, but basically, thank you. Basically, I'm I'm not like I'm basically like down on the ground, and now just like trying to like, I can't even focus on Aria. I'm just trying to focus on not passing out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, how do folks react to the collapsed Grumba? Well, he's not going to help us shut this thing. 
Arya, shoot it! Shoot the bow! I think everyone wants you to shoot the bow. I think you should shoot the bow as well, personally. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Um, <laughs> Not like you're goading or anything. Yeah. Okay. I would just be like, I don't know, shooting it somewhere where it can't really do much harm, so whatever looks like, I don't know, a patch of... Giant wall of flame. Grass that's not <laughs> gonna. Oh, okay. Yeah, shooting it. But yeah, but by shooting it yeah. into the flame, it might not. I mean, that's I think what they want you to do. <laughs> we'll join to shoot it into the flame portal to see if that'll close it. Oh. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, I can do that. I mean, worst case scenario, whatever's in the portal is gonna get a flying arrow coming towards them. Oh, um, exactly. It's probably oh, it's gonna do them a bit of damage, so you know. Or, or it flies out of another portal somewhere else in the world and stabs some person, <laughs> and you're like, "Wait, what? <laughs> Stupid portal!" Yeah. <laughs> <I> sent <guess>. it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah. What? Fucking oh, hell! Whoops. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have descriptions. Now. Oh god, I just did something to my screen. Uh, yeah, you fire an arrow into the fire. And then mark off an arrow. Yes, one moment. <laughs> As everyone. I'm guessing that. Can it make light? No. An extra 2d6 step! Oh my god! You literally just that fi fired thing the bow. Is OP. This is fantastic! There, you just knocked an arrow. Pulled the string back, fired, boom, into the flame. Done. Done. N nothing different from you firing a bow any other time, other than this time it was at a big fire. Ah, uh, the bow went on fire. Put it on fire. I don't know why I pressed it twice, but yeah. She can't yet, because she's not attuned to it yet. No, but when you are, you do lose the arrows every time. That's one thing's worth mentioning. Yeah, I think she's lost that one that should have shot into the fire anyway. Well, yeah, she's yeah, yeah. Probably willing to go in and look for it, but. <laughs> 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 the, um... Yeah, how about now? <laughs> now, keep in mind, the bow isn't on fire now, so if you fire an arrow at something she could feasibly recover it from, there is a chance, right? Yeah. As long as she fires two before she collects them, <laughs> she gets one back. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, how about now? Yeah. <sighs> this is broken. <laughs> Did you roll damage there for that? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was curious by accident. I was curious if it has the thing, but I think you'd have to roll the 2d6 uh, separately. Yeah. Uh, weirdly, I assumed it would be on, but maybe it isn't. Maybe because it's, it's a condition. It needs I to don't be mind. Clear, so yeah, no, I mean, I based on what I typed, but yeah. But apparently not. I'll edit it in a second. Because um, in theory it should, and then we should just be able to ignore the extra damage when we choose to, because it should roll everything in one go. I'll fix that just now. It's probably just a box that hasn't been ticked somewhere. Alright, I'll try not to touch anything on your character sheet just now. I'll see if I can I'm fix not. that. Just in case it appeared twice. Right, so that's there. Open this up. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, yep, literally. I have to say, part of me is like, why do I have this? Because Kitty's the expert, you know, crossbow person. Well, not crossbow. Because you're the is mistress crossbow? of the flame. It's a bow. Not mine, hers. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not complaining. I'm just like, hmm. Fancy. Uh, that, in theory, if it actually clicks. There we go. Whoa! It works now. Fuck! Broken! But obviously, conditions, etc. Um, yeah, so. Yep, everyday stares at you firing an arrow into the fire. Nothing happens. Well, that was disappointing. Yeah. Big Inferno continues to burn. Anyone else got any crazy ideas? Mm. Grumbar, do you stand back up or do you just sit there? I'm just thinking, yeah, so by now I've probably stood back up. 
Kick off. Um, but I'm still well, like. You can make it rain. Um. <laughs> Who's rich? <laughs> no. <Love it>. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna kind of stumble towards Aria again. Be like, <laughs> I like that you walk through like the the cloud of like light and lightning storm. Mm. Walk through like waving it away like beats in a doorway. Mm. <laughs> um, Get out of here, cloud! <laughs> Got to here and in infernal, I just uh, kind of shout at Aria, like, "Who are you?" And obviously, he just starts barking at you in some kind of fiery, crackly noise. Sounds much like the roaring fire over there. Until he counts down, oh. the light will engulf him. <laughs> 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 he looks really dramatic and tired. Bear, bear in mind, like right now, I am like I'm still like holding my side. I'm using my hammer as a crutch and just yeah, There's a bunch of golden order plasters like magically yeah. falling over him. <laughs> so if I understood hit? correctly, you're talking at me in Infernal. Yeah. Can, yeah, he definitely is making the same noises that creature made when it was like, your quote, speaking to you. Um, but you still um, have no idea what he's actually saying. Guys, I think whatever that creature was doing, I think is contagious. I don't yeah. know how, but but it gave it the crumb bar. Like, suddenly his his words make no sense now, it's just crackling. Is <laughs> is are, you, are we hearing the same thing here? It's fine, I shall keep the light on him. Let's all <laughs> imprison him. Back in common. Uh, imperial, just... but yeah, okay. <laughs> um, oh yeah, it's imperialism. <laughs> uh, at least I didn't say English. Uh, um, forgot what I was going to say now, damn it. Right, so she's basically <laughs> said it's contagious. He seems to be crackling the same way that creature was crackling. Grumblers. No, I Grumblers. was trying to cat... I was trying to cat see if I could catch you out. Um, that thing followed her commands. Apparently she is the mistress of the flame. I do not trust her right now. I only said what you told me to say! What was I saying, by the way? <laughs> Standing on oh, wheels. Imagine yeah. that Crumber had just replied back to her. Kill me. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I totally could have done that. Oh. oh dear. God, that would have been funny. Uh, nah, I'm not that mean. Fun with languages. <laughs> um. So yeah, there's like a weird tension, right? With this, like, this backdrop of this roaring inferno in the background, with like Eric slowly moving lights towards people. So the, th the thing that I'm finding funny as well, or what I reckon Crumbar be kind of finding really weird to understand, is obviously the fact that no one else is really on my side, and and I'm like, because obviously they didn't understand what the hell that thing was saying, but I'm not really thinking that mm -hmm. straight just now. I'm just like, guys, it's, it's obvious. She's she's clearly not who she says she is. Why are you not, like, all okay with her? Like, what? Mm -hmm. And it, it's fair. a valid con concern, though, right? <laughs> uh, the only person so far in this party who is who they say they are is me, so far. <laughs> ah, so you would say that. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever you are. <laughs> I mean, I... I've said who I am. I don't know these extra things that happened to me. Well, you're secretly a llama, so... Yeah, we discussed <laughs> that, remember? <laughs> I, I don't know that. I've got no memory of that. All shall be revealed in the French part. <laughs> <laughs> Worryingly, yes. I am. <laughs> That's another point to be who I say I am. I to stay in the head, head and temple for 20 years, not seeing anybody, so... Maybe it's just been out in the world, but yeah. Yeah. Um, it's a bit weird there. Mm. Yeah, so uh, when you look at right, your character to, backstory, just... yeah, like when you look at your character backstory there, uh, Reach, and you're sitting going, wait a minute, am I me? <laughs> just to uh, just to roll it back around to just before I forget what she was actually saying there. Um, 
Well, her, her words were, what was I saying anyway? Or what did you tell me to say? I told you to get it to stand down. Uh, okay. as, as it followed your orders. And I'm starting to think you really don't understand Infernal. Oh, it's Infernal then. You sound surprised. I mean, if you don't believe her, you yeah. can always try to roll insight on her. Yeah. Can I? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, disadvantage, though, yeah. Mm -hmm. the... So, at this point, what does Crumbar think? Scott, you just tell me what you think from that response, because the role doesn't help you or hinder you in that way. I'm not going to tell you what Crumbar feels mm. about Arya's responses. Do you so, think she's bullshitting you? If so, that's what Crumbar believes. Here is what I'm thinking. In my head, in Crumbar's head, is she is some wee elf of the woods. Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Who doesn't seem to understand Infernal and doesn't know she's the mistress of the flame. She's also specifically not a wood elf either, which is shifty. Oh, is she not? I thought you were. Half elf, every single intro. Ah, I know, but I thought like <laughs> you'd be a half wood elf, nope. or if that makes sense. Oh, right, fair enough. Half elf, um, aren't specifically half elf. I know that sounds weird, but it's, sometimes you're just fate same, same way half, Same way half orc isn't. Yeah. Oh, you're right, cool. Uh, God damn it, Ryan. I know. <laughs> right, so basically I'm thinking it's like is she like lost her memory or something or does she just or is she playing dumb or is she So is your to... instinct not that you immediately distrust her but that she is somehow being used? Is that what you're yeah. like, trying to like so, so, so Yeah, instead of thinking that she's secretly trying to screw us over now, I'm thinking maybe she's the one getting screwed over but at the same time I'm still not very trusting and I'm like I mean should I should I should I just inquisit this bitch and throw a hammer at her keep but... in mind <laughs> you were all taken to individual rooms and you all came back to a horizon sorry Ryan, you're, you're cutting out am there, I actually because I could hear me yeah, fine <laughs> weirdly <laughs> um, funny that yeah so I heard you're all taken to individual yeah things. that's all I said you're all taken to individual rooms in horizon Right, but you all walked in on Arya sitting down with Justoria first, right? So, is that something Crumbar thinks of to add to the suspicion, or is that? Thing? It is no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking of things that Crumbar has witnessed of Arya, though. Yeah, but the thing is, I don't think Justoria would have. Why would Justoria send us here if she knew that? Yeah, why would she send her uh, lieutenant? Uh, uh, I mean, yeah. Arya. <laughs> Okay, so her response to me there was it was infernal. Yeah, like she, she had no idea. Yeah, she was like, oh, that was infernal. Okay. What do you know of the Mistress of the Flame? Would I have heard of that before? I mean, have you? Would it be like a uh, knowledge, knowledge arcana, whatever, tech? Nope. You haven't. If I ever heard anything like that before? Nope. No. So I'd be like, your yeah, guess is as good as mine. I don't know anything about this. Like, you could maybe try, like, history at disadvantage, or maybe arcana at disadvantage, but it would be like one in a million shot. And it would be like random yeah. people that you have passed that have said things, if that makes sense. Fair enough. But you can give it a go if you want. So, arcana or history, right? Yeah. I know nothing. <laughs> yeah, no, like the term Mistress of the Flame doesn't absolutely no recollection at all of nothing. Not even like similar to or anything like that. Nope. Okay, I'm going to try something here. Is it, so, while they two are having this 
slightly intense. Crumbar seems to be working out why is this person betraying us. What is the thoughts going through the rest of the party <laughs> members, right? Because we've had a lot of Arya and Crumbar there. So, like, we've got Eric watching the situation. We've got, and obviously Eric's got a lot going on in his own head, never mind wondering what Crumbar thinks about Arya. And we've got Kitty, who distinctively has been hiding things. And we've <laughs> got Reach. So, what's everybody else? The other three, the quieter members so far. Um... What's your thoughts and feelings on this this interaction? What's happening? Like, what's your characters? Do you trust Arya? Do you not? Are you think are you thinking Crumbar's just gone tired, mad? Like, yeah, suffering from exhaustion. Mm -hmm. Be a good time to have a sleep, but maybe not here. Uh, Arya, have you? Do you have any knowledge now about that hellhole, or is it just the same? Uh, just do you just know the same about? It? Have you gained anything? Any knowledge about the hellhole? No. 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 Uh, that thing hasn't taught you anything? It looks as though it's in your bow now? I mean, I'd That's like to spend thing. a bit more time with my bow and, like, in investigate it properly, see what it yeah, all means, right. what it's done to it. Given that you're a druid as well, you probably took a bit of time picking the wood for your bow, right? Yeah. So... That was probably a slightly more elaborate process than just buying it from a shop. Yeah. Even if we ignore the part where I think we picked it off bandits, but that's fine. <laughs> we'll ignore that. It was very carefully selected. <laughs> what, about, uh, what about Kitty? Would a short rest be a good idea? I mean, you've got a campfire already, so you're sorted. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Won't be exhausted, because, you know... We aren't had to exhaust ourselves by finding firewood and stuff. Just remember, this place doesn't really like people, though. Remember that weird vibe yeah. of uncomfortableness? Yeah. I want to try something, though. <coughs> well, it's, I still so hang with bef you. Before we do anything with you and Crumber, I want to yeah. give both Eric and uh, Kitty the yeah, chance yeah, to do I... something. And if if they're happy to carry on. Yeah, just, I was just saying just before we agree on like a breath or anything like that. Okay, anything you'd like to throw in? Well, I'm just wondering if it's like the juggler's dagger that I got back from when we fought the pirate ship thing. Because mm. that's got some magical energy to it. Mm. That's a good point. You've still not done in with that, have you? Has, really I was going to say, well, hasn't she? <laughs> <laughs> I think Crumbar's seen at least. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Just wondering if it's anything like that. So I'm just sort of like looking at the bow being very inquisitive probably looks like i'm trying to steal it but i'm not I promise maybe mm -hmm. hmm. uh, eric well uh watching this uh back and forth between an angry orc and a druid i kind of notice the bones on the altar <laughs> you know what they are yet <laughs> <laughs> you can I go over and investigate? Yeah, do you want to go investigate the bones? Uh, investigation, are you? Yeah. Oh. It's a pile of bones. Uh, I think this <laughs> just explains it. Maybe you're exhausted too. <laughs> Maybe that's just a thing that uh, the dice have added in for you. <laughs> Hmm. Right, okay. I mean, edit one line of this text because something Stu mentioned isn't correct. What was that? What did I mention? Uh, it's about the bow. Yeah, yeah well, it's okay. I taught you anything. No, not that it's part. Okay. It was more to do with the wording of it. Right. Only when the bow is active does it burn up the animal. Yeah. That's what I'm adding in. Yeah. Because that is important. I'll put it in there so that it has become part of the rules. Excellent. Right, so. What is the plan then? So you're going to go investigate that. You see a bunch of remains carved up. Bones seem to be scattered across an altar. 
they seem to be kind of brittle looking, I guess. That's about it. Huh. Just gonna look, look over at everyone fighting again. Do you reckon these bones might do something? I ain't got a clue. You oh, worry about... It's Can you black dark magic. I would be very careful touching them. That's, who knows what the, the influence they could have. Oh. I mean, do you reckon they might be able to shut this thing down behind me? I don't know, hit him with your hammer. Find out. No, it's charged. Oh. Can, can I destroy the bones? How? how do I just. I mean, keep in mind, your hammer is still a hammer. Yeah, okay. I just like kind of crush the bones with my hammer. Like, keep in mind, Not you need to engine. actively want to use that Eye of the Storm thing. So, I mean, I did actively want to do it when I hit my book, you did. but you know. You did. Yeah. We're casting a <laughs> magic. <laughs> so, maybe it's not always up to you. Maybe the eye gets to see. Maybe. Mm -hmm. I'm going to carefully, the, the bristle, as you said, so I'm going to carefully tap each one and try to destroy it. <laughs> Trying to run that sentence by me again? I want to carefully <laughs> tap each one to destroy it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the bristle. So I'll tap them, and hopefully they'll shatter or crack. Should I give or... an attack roll? Uh... Attack roll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um... Tap. Oh, lightning! I forgot he did that. <laughs> yeah. So you hit the uh, the bone. You tap it. There is like a kind of reddish spark of lightning, and yeah, it. Pops. Just turns to dust. Quite violently. <laughs> Not gentle at all. I mean, the tap was definitely gentle, but then it was like touching something with jump cables. <laughs> <laughs> yep, that did nothing. Can I grab the dust and throw it behind me at the wall? It's kind of like puffed out in all directions, so. Yeah, and anything that would have landed is probably lying in the blood. Huh. Okay. I mean, you oh. probably got like your fingers covered in dust if you really wanted some dust on your fingertip. And then can I blow it out the wall? Like... Not really. No. <laughs> Not really enough to do that. No. You could go up and just put your finger into the wall of fire with the dust on it. Uh, <laughs> I feel like that would be a fool's errand. I mean, I'll just get my dice pool ready. <laughs> <laughs> You've survived a pretty big attack before, so... <laughs> yes. <laughs> what, would it be 10, uh, like, D12s this time now? Who knows? Just no save this time, because you're actively going into it. Um... <laughs> I've walked through portals before. <laughs> I mean... Yeah, right. I should run my lights into it. <laughs> Do you want? What happens? Yeah, it fizzles up. It's gone. Yep. Mm -hmm. Anyone else get any bright ideas? Well, I'm not walking into that flaming hole. <laughs> <laughs> Rule one of monk school. If you happen across the flaming hole, try and avoid it. <laughs> Circumvent. I feel like I'm the only one that's trying to shut this thing down. <laughs> to be fair, Arya did fire her bow into it as asked, so... Yeah, sure, good faith. You tell me to do stuff, I do stuff. Jump over the bridge. I mean, yeah. Wow. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Savage. <laughs> I think the only way we have of closing this is talking to Princess Justoria. Right now, I want to speak to Arya a bit. Mm -hmm. So, Reach, do you say that to the group that you need to speak to Justoria? Yeah. Oh, sorry, were you saying yes. that? Was... Yeah, okay. yeah. Yep. So. Do I need to say Reach says? No. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I, 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 didn't, I didn't realize you were saying that in character, mate. 
Yeah. So, yeah. Maybe that snaps everybody back, because just maybe the mention of, you know, Justoria's name maybe brings everybody out of the... Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that giant fiery pit thing! Mm -hmm. I want... Uh, I just interrupt. Uh, going, I want to know more about who Arya really is. So, I'm gonna turn to her. Point my finger and... Oh, sorry, turn to her and say... Tell me your history. And then, as, I, as I've said that, I'm going to point my finger at her. I'm going to use command. And oh I God. am going to say truth. What? So, yeah, you need to basically roll it. Was it was, uh, a wisdom save? Sure. So, um, just so you should know, Crumbry, you need to say something slightly different. Saying truth isn't mm -hmm. a command. Ah, bastard. Speak the truth. That's, it needs to be a one word command, I believe. It needs to be a one word okay. command. Ah, bastard. <laughs> confess. <laughs> there you go. Did that work? I mean, that, that would work. <laughs> okay, confess. <laughs> yep. Okay. Um, I love trees. <laughs> so I need to. <laughs> oh, come on, I that's had a not a <laughs> night with a tree. <laughs> Yeah, so and also, it's not a secret. I mean, probably the the biggest secret yeah, that you true. guys will find out would be that I That's love okay. my bird more than any. <laughs> That's okay. You don't have to reveal anything yet. Wisdom, you can roll yeah. a wisdom save. Yeah, yep. <laughs> There's no disadvantage. Remember, so it doesn't matter. It's a thirteen anyway. 13. Yep. Yeah. Uh, can't remember what it is. Yeah. Should be on your spell sheet. Uh, I'm reading through it, you know. At the top. Uh, I've got that, but... Very top. Two, very top. Mm -hmm. And, uh... Nope. Uh, Much further up. On your spell sheet. On your character yeah, sheet. Yeah, uh, on my character sheet. On your sheet, spells sorry. page. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, I'm on the, on the spells page. Very top. Very, very top. Very, very top. Ah, right there. There oh, we fast. go. <laughs> uh, a 12. <laughs> yup. <laughs> so, let's talk about this, right? Yeah, what does this look cool. like when Crumber does this? Like, what is the visual we get? Is there, like, glowing gold eyes? Yeah. Is there, like, a shimmer so, of, like, just think, just the ground tremor a tiny bit? Like, what's the... You so, know, what, what's happened is I've turned around and basically said, I want to know more, tell me your... Tell me your history, and then as I've said, confess. It's almost like it's like a kind of echoey, dragony voice. Confess. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like there's like hundreds of reverb, and it's like mm -hmm. the air coming out of my mouth has like a golden tinge to it. Yeah, I like that. That's awesome. And maybe like the camera does that thing where we stare face on at you. Your eyes have that slight flash of gold, slightly dragony and the, eyes. And the camera, camera starts rumbling, and yeah, like when yeah. Gladio's well, like, "Nah, I don't want the ringmate." Cheers, though. <laughs> yeah. Well, that is fine. I, I know. She, I know she failed the the command. Well, you don't. She... You don't though. At no point does no, this I mean, say I'm, that I'm... Like, you learn what happens. So, yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, I know that Crumbar doesn't, but I know that I know that obviously she's oh. failed. Uh, she I failed the wisdom save, but that doesn't mean she can't still tell us. So all the words time. here are that she succeeded her wisdom save against your. Spell. Yeah. Yep. That's fine. So. Yeah. Arya, you I feel this golden reverb for lack of a better term like rumble out of crumbar um and it washes over you and like you obviously mentally have to check this off um can you roll let's see just perception and if you've got disadvantage from it, it like exhaustion or whatever or if you don't Roll with or without disadvantage. I think you do have exhaustion, though, so roll with. So, sorry, which way do I roll it? I, I have disadvantage, so... If you have exhaustion, you're rolling with... Yeah, if you have yeah. exhaustion, you're rolling with disadvantage. I deleted it. No, we're good. Okay, so... That's a 12. That's fine, yeah. So... You... Please notice how I had a natural 20 there. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, girl. That one level of uh, exhaustion is killer, isn't it? Um, 
So, you you know he has actively tried to compel you to do something against your will. Yeah. So you know that. How do you respond? Because he's just said in kind of golden reverb, CONFESS! Well, the golden thing would not really, you know, impress me much because, you know, we have the blue boy over there and, you know, the <laughs> random cat that became a dark elf. Sorry, a wood elf. Um, so, you know, that, that, that aspect doesn't quite, you know, throw me, I would say, as much as, you know, the fact that, you know, we've been buddies for so long and suddenly he's trying to compel me to, you know get information out of me which granted I'm like how do I put this um like I know I've done nothing wrong mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. but just the idea that somebody's trying that to 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 that I trust and you know saved the ass of so many times mm -hmm. um not that he hasn't saved mine but still um a mutual ass yeah. savory yes Exactly. We we've been involved in in, in this mutual assay free yeah. business for for a while now, and we suddenly he's like, you know, trying to compel me to do something instead of first asking nicely and be like, "Tell me." <laughs> um, well, bear in mind, maybe that's why because I'm so angry because I thought that we had built. Yeah, up but this I don't friendship. give a shit. But that makes oh. proper sense, though, right? Because obviously, Crumber would be like. We've been through so much together, and I find out there's more to learn. How dare you be weirdly evil, maybe? And then Arya's been like, literally, all I've needed you to do is have my back when I've needed you and I've kept you alive, and I really like birds, and oh my god, mm. and now you're trying to compel me. I really like. So, in that scene, then, right, what's Arya's response to Crumbar? So, I'd be very much. Um... Also, if anybody else wants to have uh, tried to notice what he's done, it's an arcana check, just so you know. Also, with your respective disadvantages, if they apply. If I, I don't see with him glowing and all that. Don't we just know? Uh, no. Uh. No, because okay. no, it's about learning what That's he actually did. Kidding. Something glowing gold could be about 20 different spells. <laughs> <laughs> you know he used magic. That's not hidden. <laughs> um, Wait, are we roll it to see if we know. Well, the only if you yet. wanted to. Also, I take it, Rich, you don't have exhaustion, do you? I think you were the one of the few that didn't. Uh, or I did do, you? Actually. Do you? Then roll again. Yeah, okay. Right. That's fine. It's the 11. <laughs> yeah. But no, you don't know what it is. You just know he's doing something from his training <laughs> as a paladin. Anyway, uh, I could still see. Crumbar of whatever magic you're doing is is more suited for the enemy and not for the friends. That's mm -hmm. that that is yeah, I think I'll just be a bit quite like offended. A bit pissed off, yeah, offended, like how dare you? Have I been nothing but you know well not supportive but like I mean I would say you literally know, have support. I done yeah. Anything but yeah, you you have quite you have quite literally been the helped definition whenever. of support. But what are you actually yeah. saying though? Is this just internalized in Arya's head? Because obviously, is it just Reach's voice that like breaks the tension wherever they're staring at each other awkwardly after the the golden reverb, and then you've got Reach going, "Grumbar, magic's best used against the enemy, not against each other." Ooh, wrap it up. <laughs> I put a hand behind my back and ready a ray of frost in case Grumbar does anything silly. <laughs> Define no. silly more, please, Eric. Especially in respect to Crumbar. <laughs> if, he get, if he increases hostility and goes forward to attack. There's two things there, so yeah. So if it makes an attack, or is he, if he gets more aggressive, because there are two different things there. Gets more aggressive. Right, okay, cool. You're ready. Rhea Frost against Crumbar if he gets more aggressive. Cool. Yes. Cool. Uh... As Re as Reach has said that to me about you know mm -hmm. it's better to use it against foes rather than friends, um, I've just replied back at this point I don't know what she is anymore. The same friend she's uh, always I'd... been. Oh. Yeah, I'd be like, 
Thank you, Rage. Also, when have I ever done anything that would make you doubt me? Like, I don't know what was going on there, but I have not ever done anything but help you all and, and you know, work towards our common goal. Not you personally, no, but that demon was clearly attached to you. And I don't know why. I didn't even know what it was saying until you told me. Hmm. I love that your suspicion is true, though, because you can don't I? know, right? You don't know how to believe is that, her. Can I roll to see if she's lying? You did. Remember? Ah, uh, yeah, shit, yeah. I mean, like, now? Nope. It's not been that okay. long. <laughs> You can't just roll to win. Seconds. <laughs> I'm just trying to. I'm, I was just hoping it would help me. I know, but no. Nah, that was that mm. was your insight on her. It is a four. Because <laughs> it's the same it. thing you're trying to insight, right? It's not like she's now breaking bread yeah, and you're like, yeah, are you now trying to poison me? <laughs> I'd yeah, so I, I, I'm, I'm like raging a little bit, but also like, you know, I'm like gonna go to reach for outrage. Like, yeah. So you like step away from Arya then? No, no, I'm, I'm just gonna kind of call over and go reach. You, you know, the Golden Orders stand on uh, associating with demons. How can you stand there and defend her? What What is your reasoning? She's had plenty of chance to let us die in the past. I can't see that being her uh, aim or goal. That's... So why do you think this demon is calling her mistress of the flame and appears to be attached to her? I love that I only love Crumbar to... knows that. I love that only Crumbar knows that's what it said. But, yeah. She's mistress of the No, I remember I, I said that when... Um, yeah, but only you our know our... that. No, I, I, Nobody I said else to... speaks Infernal. Yeah, yes, but remember I said... Word. Did I not say to reach Yes, when we were... but only you know. Oh, yeah. right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. Right. so it's kind of like me saying something in, I don't know... Spanish and none of you speak Spanish and I tell right. you that it means I love you a lot and it actually means I want to kill your it brother, is. you know? Yeah. Right, right. Sorry, I get what you mean now. Right, mm -hmm. sorry. Um, <laughs> sorry, sorry, man. Are I did that bad GM thing of just repeating the same words. Mm. <laughs> yeah. You're a British person on holiday. How dare you. Um, oh. Right, sorry, mate. What were you saying there? Yeah. Anyway, I can... S uh, I do know. Admit the thing appearing, half killing you, and then disappearing into Arya's sword uh, and uh, her bow. It's weird, but I don't understand it, so I can't really jump to conclusions until I do understand it. I agree, and I would like to spend some time examining this bow, and obviously you guys can feel free to do the same as well. I want to see... I don't know what's been done to it. But we need to find that out. We also need to close this big fiery ass portal. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but by this point, your spells fizzled out, by the way. If we chucked an Eric on it, you think that would help? Well, it can't hurt. Yeah. <laughs> at, this <laughs> at this point, I don't know what to think anymore. Um, but re I'll st I'll stand down for now, and I just kind of, you know, just sit ease down. Off. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Slump. Ba down. Basically, sit sit down, but try and make it look casual without me showing everyone that. Yeah, I'm still in a lot of campaign. I don't even know if you, that there's a lot to hide in that regard because I mean they've seen you. Well, oh yeah, you, like, I mean you took uh, a lot of the hits from this thing. Uh, remember, like this thing like laid into you specifically. Um, mm. So yeah, like I don't think MD's 
If anything, they're probably kind of impressed that you're still standing, regardless, like even regardless of like the healing and such, because yeah, yeah, that is a. Yeah. If you look at the actual amount of damage you took, and anyone that wants to do all the maths to that can, I don't care. But like, mm -hmm. that yeah. is pretty impressive, regardless. I think enemy. just. Mansell I think is, just, is enemy. Uh, feel free to keep a close eye on Arya. Uh, make sure she. I'm sure she'll keep healing you as much as she has in the past. That's, but for now, yeah, there's nothing we can do other than yeah, let Arya investigate this bow. Fine. In fact, I've got a better idea. I am going to move over to this nice pile of rocks and just kind of lean up against them mm -hmm. so I've actually got some support. And while I'm leaning there, my gaze is just going between Arya and the big fiery doom portal mm -hmm. and just going back and forth as I just try and think of what to do. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. What's everybody else doing? Uh, I wouldn't mind. Well, I've got four water skins and I can fill them up with that water down there at the bottom left, so I'm going to try and pour my four water skins over just one small area of that flame hole. See if it makes any dent in it at all. Okay, yep, so how long do you spend doing that, roughly? As long as it takes to empty four water skins. Yeah, uh, um, so right, we'll have you do that in the back, because that'll maybe take a bit of time, right? Going up, emptying yeah. four, and then going back and filling them. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm not going to empty them again, I just want to fill them after that and see what happens, yeah. Cool. Right, um, on... While he's off doing that, what's everybody else up to? What's Arya and... So well, Kitty. I was gonna say Sophie. What's Kitty and uh, Eric doing? Staring at the firewall, trying to come up with solutions. Mm -hmm. Like hand on chin, move a hand on the elbow, just like. Hmm. Uh, so I'm. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I've lost more health. No, it was just me being blind. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go investigate the bones, see if I can see anything with them. Sure. Oh. Uh, what would it be? Investigation. Yep, at disadvantage. Yeah, disadvantage on. Dang it. Um, it looks like lightning has struck the table in one spot. <laughs> <laughs> Where did lightning come from? Hmm. <laughs> Hammer's actually still sat there on the altar <laughs> as he's stroking his chin, holding his elbow. With with the Pikachu attached to it. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually Pikachu hidden inside it. Um, <laughs> got a red tint on it, the icon as well, obviously, hence what's red lightning. It's not that evolved, it's just a Pichu. <laughs> <laughs> it's a plus hole. Because um, <laughs> it's red. Um, yeah, no, like you walk up, bunch of bones. Like it's. Yeah, there's very little left on here. A kind of bit of a bloody bone soup. I sort of look at him, look at Eric, and just sort of give him a. We can't take you anywhere kind of look to it. I am not paying attention, I'm looking at the file. Yeah. Cool guys, <laughs> look at explosions. <laughs> It's not an explosion yet. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, yeah, what does everybody do then? Because you're kind of just standing about. Like, I don't know what Reach is up to, but like, yeah. So Reach goes up, you pour four water skins onto it, they sizzle and go away because it's really, really fucking hot up against this thing. You probably get to the point where you stand, like, Good ten feet, maybe away from it, because of the heat, and then do we throw have, water sorry. in, and then that's it. It just turns to steam. Do we have any way of summoning Justoria here? Yeah, someone's got a ba bracelet from her. It's the opposite way around, I think, is it not? We go back to where Justoria is. I mean, you don't actually know. <laughs> I mean, that's that's like that's a good point. Like she basically sent us here, but didn't really tell us how to close these. Well, her but, her words were. Go find out what is there. Not go get involved in somebody else's business. 
Then don't go get involved in somebody else's business. Yeah, crumb um, <laughs> Smashing up the hill now. Well, I mean, we've found out what's here. Mm -hmm. Yep, he's completed yeah. that goal. Yep. It would be a good idea to go back and have thought that, yeah, the, if there's a shortcut, the bracelet you use it, I've been thinking as well. But Yeah, yeah. Um, because then, you know, we can, because, I mean, this kind of needs addressed, so I don't really fancy an eight-day walk with <laughs> back. For also you, it'd be a 16-day walk, given your exhaustion. Yeah. No. Also, also, the fact that tensions are high between me and Arya. Um, I mean, I Eric really has a hammer think. that can take you pretty much anywhere. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Watch yeah, the, yeah. Hollywood to take his anger. <laughs> 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 Are you trying to imply that being near a hellhole would somehow affect the warp jump, right? Yeah. <laughs> I think we should yeah. get a fair distance away before doing any of that stuff. Mm -hmm. Can yep. I also just point out that... <laughs> Can I also just point out that Kitty has not looted the dead bodies yet? <laughs> I didn't realise there was... Oh, God. I was actually yeah. planning and Sorry, can, can we all just take a moment to just worry about the rogue person that was like a cat one minute and a wood elf the next, covered in daggers, who went, oh, I didn't even realise we'd killed all those people. <laughs> That's really <laughs> worrying. People, they're not on the screen anymore that I can see, so I forgot about them. I just love the idea that you've murdered your way through no, six I'm people just... and we're like, who? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, I'm just wondering. Do you think I'm just trying to think of ways that we can close this without having to go back? Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking, do you think they might have something on them? I reckon the one that would have uh, was behind that thinly veiled barrier. Yeah, but I mean, the bodies are right there. So would it be worth checking them before we teleport back? Yeah, it's worth also investigating the tents, the bodies. Mm. Uh, yeah, definitely. I will keep oh, watching the hellhole. You know what? I completely forgot about the tent that Eric came out of. He never came out of a tent. <laughs> he was he a came man. out of the tent. He, he, he that was a back. distinctively that's a Frenchman's hut. I'll have you know. Uh, <laughs> I, I mean, how it works in my head is Eric just stayed in the horizon and then just teleported into the hut. <laughs> I was here the whole time. I didn't have to go travelling. Why well, are you guys all beaten up? Travelling by foot? How pedestrian. Right. <laughs> hey, blah, blah, blah. Um, right, okay. So, I think the summary here is Reach has emptied some water out. He's emptied four water skins onto a big fire and he's filled up his water skins with dire wood water. Reach, make a note. Yeah, I was thinking that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. I was, yeah. You got What's some good old direwood water? water. It's the water he filled yeah. his 4A uh, water skins up with. How is it any different than normal water? How, well, well, how was, yeah, I was going to say, yeah, how was resting here any different than normal resting? Yeah. Remember all okay. those dead animals on the way here? No? Yeah, I ain't touching that water. I was so, sticking my jug. Yeah. So, right. So yeah, that's a thing. Reach, you don't have to have filled them if you wish to have remembered this. <laughs> it's alright, if we need to touch someone, we'll just give them that to drink. Give them yeah. depression. Yeah, wow. Okay. Okay. I have to give them what is giving depression. There. <laughs> right, so you've got that, right? So, yeah. are you gonna... What, take search a short the... rest, take, search from corpses, search from tents, investigate uh, a bangle, should... investigate a bow, leave this place, stay, like... Search, search the right. tents? It's search tents and bodies. Let's just go about business. Yeah. Right. Right. Yep, so we take a bit of time. Who's all searching? Everybody just searching, I take it? Everybody, I think. Yeah. yeah. Would they not want to? I think we all want it. Yeah, it can oh. use roll investigate normally. Somebody can do that. Whoever's taking point on this. Normally. Uh, oh. Dips any loot. Hmm. Oh, is it investigate? Dang. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Reach, yeah. Reach can oh. do that. Okay. Uh, roll a d6. Cool. You find five healing potions. Randomly scattered over the men. Ironically. And then, yeah, they've all got like a scimitar each. So that's really the gist of what you find from the dudes. And then in the tents, it's literally just like 
blankets and like food. Can we top up our rations from it? Those, yeah. Yeah, if you want. Uh, I'll roll a d10 plus 5, I guess. Nine. <coughs> yeah, so there's 9 rations there. Right. I have no. <laughs> this is true, but you also have like, what, pockets with what, one potion in it? <laughs> And my book somewhere. Yeah, your book Ash. and your uh, hammer. <laughs> well, <laughs> you can, how um, many right? If you want, you can you can have a backpack from that tent if you really want a backpack again. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I would like a backpack. Er Eric can have a backpack. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, right, if there's nine rations, I'm going to take two of them, given the eight in total. Well, I've still got seven rations left, so I'm fine to give mine to Eric, so he's got some food. Or he can just have the rest that's in the tent. He can have the rest. I've got six back. Yeah, he can have the rest. Nice. How many is that? You're okay, You're okay are you? You can do... Uh, yeah. What you call it? Magic. Those good berries. Berries and stuff. Yeah, that's good berries. That's the one. Uh, there's seven left, mate. There's seven rations. Wait, is there nine... So, there's nine yeah. rations, right? Hi, sorry, I've taken two, so yeah, there's seven left. Nine rats. <laughs> right, does everybody want to type in how many rats they currently have before they're adding rats, right? <laughs> Thank God it wasn't number the beast. It's next door. <laughs> <laughs> um, Arya, you still with us? Cause yeah, I was just reading. Okay. Apparently that's a missed translation as well. I can't remember what the number of the beast is. Oh, was right. Like it's not like Hebrew for WWW. So. Yeah. Uh, right, okay. So, that's maybe a better way to work out how you want to divide that number up. Yeah, um, okay. So, Aria take two. Okay. And then... Eric just takes the rest. Yeah. Seven, then, yeah? Yeah. And Aria got two. Go up to six. Got that? Yay! Cool. Yay! Excellent. <laughs> Yay! Food! Excellent. The nature food person has <laughs> least, least food, apart from the naked source of it. I'm not naked! <laughs> Very <laughs> nice clothes, quite brief. frankly. At yeah. the moment. <laughs> and the best looking clothes out of the lot of us, thank you. <laughs> I don't know, like, golden armor, like, granted, Crumbar's armor is probably pretty fucking beat up, right? The, mm. uh, Probably looks pretty awesome, you know. Um, I'm the fanciest person here. Holds <laughs> teacup and sticks pinky out. Sing singular. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say saucy, but maybe that was a bit too close to saucer. So let's not go for it. Um, right, okay. So you spend some time, probably some weird tension as you divide up the spoils. Um, can may as well make reach to it since he led with the investigate. Roll 2d20. Cool. Yeah, you find 24 gold. Hey. Yay! Uh, between 4, 5. Ach, I'll take 4 gold, everyone else take 5. Aye. Right. Right. Me. My first pennies. <laughs> Lord Eric doesn't have pennies. He's all invested. <laughs> it's a wise move. Harsh cut to those robes on the floor in that random room. <laughs> Back to like a thought bubble of me just crying. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you probably spent about 10. 10, 15 minutes raking the place, taking people's stuff off them, you know, like good noble heroes. Um, Crumbar probably sits there and people hand him things like money and food. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, but yeah, look, is the plan to wait here or. Question. Um, yes, Beyonce. Sorry. Just... <laughs> Who hands me stuff? Probably Reach. Probably, yeah. <laughs> right, go. Cool. Yeah. Uh, are you while they're doing all that and handing stuff out and whatnot? Yeah. Are you gonna check out? Do I get a chance to look at my bow? 
No, I'm asking if we're going to check out the bangle or the bow because we're almost at the point where you still have taken a short rest in front of this giant fiery thing. So we've done about say, sure. 10 to 15 minutes of messing around with stuff. So you've got about another 40 minutes before it qualifies as a short rest. <coughs> so you could just commit to having a short rest and check out the bangle or the bow. It's up to you. It depends I'd what your go plan for is. The bow, but... but is that more important yeah. to you than because obviously the the party seem to want to either leave here or okay. like do something with what trying to summon Justoria, right? That was what the last discussion yeah, was. Yeah, I think it might be best that we get the But Justoria, If you I wanna think. investigate the bow, there's nothing to say you couldn't do that while just all of you start slowly walking back out the, the place if he's wanted to leave here. I just need to know what's going on in your head so that you'll then voice it in character to everybody else. Sure. I think at this point I'd be wondering if I'd be saying something like, guys, okay, so what do we do? Do I use this this bangle to to get Justoria to come essentially fetch us? Or do we wanna travel back? How how do we do this? The fact that you've suggested that, like again is just making me more confused not because i'm like she's i've just literally called her out as a uh, as a possible enemy but she's still trying to help mm -hmm. so i'm Aww. like hmm. you know i'm like hmm. it makes sense that you would constantly try and reconcile the information you're getting though yeah i mean it does make sense uh yeah i would concentrate on the bracelet first of all that's uh, although we could have done it on eight days work work here maybe but I don't think I'll last an eight day walk back. I mean, I can get this back there fairly fast. Yeah, kind of was hoping he would suggest that, so that's kind of why I voiced that idea. Because, you know, my bangle thing is a one time thing, whereas his hammer thing isn't. Yeah, but last time we travelled through his hammer, it took like how many months? Well, how long did it take me to travel to there to? To wherever I went to write it to you guys. Yeah, when were you? Point, mm. When, where, and what was I? Yeah, exactly. So, how long did it take you to get there? This is some Doctor Who level shit. <laughs> Woo! Hardly <laughs> worthy. <laughs> yeah, well, time well, me, yeah. why me? <laughs> You're wearing Maybe sand shoes. It takes... <laughs> Maybe it takes longer to teleport if we travel as a group. Who knows? I could travel back to Horizon and find your story and then rest and teleport her back here or get her to teleport us here. If you guys want to look after the fiery hole. I'm trying to think. What are the risks? I mean, there's no chance we can take a long rest here, Ryan, I'm guessing. Mm. You could Maybe start. Like, lightly encourage exhaustion again. Yeah. Like, I'm already can, at level. I was going to say, yeah, you can definitely try it, because keep in mind, you have been rolling to not be exhausted, you have just rolled badly. Um, yeah. But you need fine, one yeah. full, uninterrupted long rest successfully to remove exhaustion one level. So, By the way, yeah. right, the I potion think... do that without rolling? The long rest potion gives you all the benefits of a long rest? Yeah, but, I mean, without any of the disadvantages of a potential disadvantages of a long rest, I feel like the wording is very specific there. Yeah. Right. I want to see his advantages. Yep. Yeah, okay. Because right. it, it's an action it's, to drink. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's quite a damn good potion, so I'd rather save it for a fight. Yeah, or a bad dungeon. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. So right now, if we can just go somewhere and have a long rest, I'd rather do that. Yep. We have 40 minutes away anyway. Uh, Arya, do your bow for the next 40 minutes. Keep then in mind, walk. he's um, Crumbar is slower, remember? Mm. Yeah, Crumbar is half speed, so you're about two hours away from whatever walking place you were thinking of. <laughs> well, right, okay. Crumbar, off you go. We'll catch up on you. <laughs> <laughs> go off into the dark woods with the dead animals yourself, Mr. Half Speed, <laughs> Half Health. <laughs> Right, so what's the plan? Are we walking away from here and then resting? Or That's are we going to use well. the bracelet yeah. and just teleport nah. back? Uh, well. You don't know what the bracelet does. 
Yeah. Oh, right, Keep in okay, mind, so it's that, just yeah. a, a bracelet that's got like la random lucky charms hanging from it. Oh, okay, right. Yeah, okay, let's go stoke trips back to the somewhere safe. Yeah. Right, so you guys are gonna all head off into the woods again? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. just to let everyone know, I'll probably need some water later on. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I will as well. <laughs> Don't worry, I've got I've got the glug jug. We're fine. Mm, uh, so we roll the d4, uh, reach because I feel like supply wise they probably have water. So we'll see what's left. Right. Uh, yeah, good point. They yeah, that makes water. sense. Yeah, I forget that rations is the only thing that you need to sustain yeah. yourself. Yeah. So there's one water skin. <laughs> there you go. If you don't mind, I'll take this. <laughs> <laughs> You're not the only one with no water, but sure. Oh shit. <laughs> we'll take half each. Sips. One for you, two for me. I mean, one for me. <laughs> um, yeah, one cool. I, is everybody happy to leave the hellhole? Yep. Yep. Right, okay. So, who's taking point? Me. Well, <laughs> the guy that's got lost too many times. I, I think. I like. I think that in my current situation and my incredible navigation skills, I should definitely not take point. I would Good. agree. <laughs> I, was I think I'm going to need assistance just walking. Yeah. Arya, if you don't mind, can you take point? If Arya wants to investigate her uh, bow on the journey, she cannot, or her, her bangle or bow, she cannot take point. But she could do it during the journey anyway. She doesn't need to stop for that. So long as she's not actively doing anything, like guiding you guys, yeah? Uh, what is the uh, point? What's the Survival skill is the skill. Uh, well, Kitty, up you go. <laughs> I'm not terrible at it, but... Uh, Why do we not trust me? I don't get it. You could survive you in a restaurant, but that's about it. I love the idea though that the next, like every scene, he's in different clothes. It's just like <laughs> it's just like a background detail. And nobody comments on the TV show. <laughs> Much like Justoria. Like, yeah. <laughs> different outfit every time you see her. Yeah. Kitty, how are you with survival? You pretty good with survival in the woods, or? Uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> It depends on the woods, to be fair. Like, these have been tainted, so they're not easier to easy to read. Yeah. Don't suppose we, can you aid someone doing a mm -hmm. point? No. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. How about both of us take point? I'll, I'll aid you, Kitty. What about me? Yeah, later. I think you're gonna need. I think you're gonna need to help me. I'm not physically strong. Reach is. I'm not physical. I was gonna say, is he though? Yeah. I'm very dexterity, so if he falls I could probably dodge out of the way, but that's be about it. <laughs> I have really nine well. strength. <laughs> I have just so little strength. Reach my actual okay. I have eight. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so what am I rolling? Right, uh, so, I'll roll first to aid you, I think. So well no no. Who's who's taking point and who's assisting the person taking right. point? Kitty's point, I'm assisting. Okay, so Kitty, roll normally for survival. Ah, right, it takes away the negative. Doesn't, doesn't matter, that's a good roll. Woohoo! Yeah, <laughs> basically, advantage and disadvantage only count once, regardless of the amount of sources. So yeah. if you're on fire, in a hurricane, in the dark, <laughs> with a blindfold, and thousands of bees screaming at you, survival is still just at disadvantage, regardless of how many sources of the <laughs> there are. We um, wouldn't question the realism of that, but yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Look yeah, where you are! <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so, yeah, I would say he's actually, you do pretty well. The only problem is that Crumbar is slowing you down, but that's it. Mm -hmm. So yeah. And no one's helping me. Yeah. I mean, I'm helping you with as best as I can. Yay! No, you could definitely be like lending a hand. I mean, I don't know what hand, because you've got a book in one and your hammer in the other. I'm lending a shoulder. You could put your book in your backpack now, actually. Yeah, oh, books in the backpack. There we go. Yeah. Oh man, you should have thrown your book in the fire. 
No. <laughs> uh, we should have thrown Aramos in the fire. We haven't got it now. Yeah. Oh, no, it makes me sad. <laughs> it looks like now you have a new person you want to throw in the fire, though. The mistress of the flame. Uh, no, because she won't burn. You don't know that. Yeah. Druids are really, I don't really know, flammable. I don't know a lot of things, it, assumes, it appears. <laughs> so. Okay. Right, so you travel for a good bit. Uh, obviously, let's say it's an hour, I guess. So if you want to have spent hit dice to heal, use can. If anything else restores on a short rest, it should say so in its abilities, and you can recharge those things if they do. Um, Does exhaustion come away at all? No. No. It's only a long oh, rest, a successful rest. long rest. I mean... Um, but you could spend hit dice to have healed more, if you yeah. have any hit dice left, that is. I've still got four, but I'm like, I'm at 26 HP. I doubt we're gonna... Or I don't think we're gonna get into any fight, so... Don't tell the DM that. <laughs> Let's just use one. <laughs> this is the time to do it, or not, essentially. Heal for six. I have no idea, it never updated me yet, so... I'm still yeah, waiting on it. Roll. You click hit dice. Have you cl actually clicked it? Yeah. We're waiting. We're waiting. Yeah. We're all waiting. Mm -hmm. Seriously? Yep, Can we yep. go internet connection? Are you still in the? <laughs> is this still in the channel? So. <laughs> I'm joking. <yeah. laughs> but obviously, roll twenty can be glitchy sometimes. But hmm. like, I'm I've got an idea. Yeah, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. I've got an idea, don't worry about it, don't worry. I mean, can you click the button again and we'll see what happens? Because if right. it sent the um, first... There you go! <laughs> nah, clearly that's photoshopped. <laughs> oh, I totally could have photoshopped it. <laughs> Twelve you can get up to, well, nice. Yeah, paladins are chunky boys. Let me just refresh my, my roll 20. I'm gonna have to refresh that. Maybe everybody should just refresh the roll twenty. Actually, I think yeah, it's maybe Crumber. I might need to refresh it. I was thinking. Yeah. Yeah. Just refresh Ooh. my browser. We'll pop back in. We'll see what happens. Or even Scott, actually. But yeah. Ah. Crumbar opens his laptop. <laughs> logs into roll twenty. <laughs> I have a laptop. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, I'm back in, and now my thing's been deleted. Yeah, it's not there, didn't we? Just, but we've got the proof. I think we do believe them, don't we? I want to see something, actually. We don't think um, his Photoshop skills are that good, at least not that quick. Yeah. Let's have a look at something. I want to know what will happen if I roll again if it gives me the same RNG. Oh, oh damn, I'll take oh. that instead! <laughs> <laughs> That's just to prove that I used one, but now I'm only going to hit six. Mm -hmm. It's updating the wheel, so that, so yeah. Uh, mines hasn't updated yet, but mines are still loading. Nope, there we go. Is it coming through now? Is it? Yeah. You see the 10 there now? I this do, time. yeah. Grumbar, just take the 10. I, I can only see the 10, so. But I got, like. Don't argue. Yeah, I'll take 10. <laughs> but but I've, I, the first time I got 600, look. <laughs> <laughs> I love that they get bigger as they go away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I would say that's almost a uh, concrete evidence that he uh, never thought he I know, before. right? Like, um, guys, if anyone knows anyone needing a graphic designer, well, <laughs> uh, yeah. my Photoshop skills are unmatched. Yeah. Plus, I just prefer the chat log that I can see to have the evidence, that's all. Um, sadly, that will work both ways, so. You know. <coughs> Sorry. Enjoys. Right, okay, so you head off. You use um, Crumber, obviously, keeping up the rear with Eric. You uh, obviously start to like recover as you kind of <laughs> walk it off, I guess. Um, is there any conversation as you go besides the two people navigating? Like, is there any conversation? Um, also, Arya, are you going to try and peruse this? Bow or bangle 
I think it said Bengal to me originally, but then the plan seemed to change, so what's the thoughts? So you could be muted. Can I get this on the kitty that's muted? Are ya? Everyone else can hear me, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can, I hear. can hear you. Good, good. Just ignoring you intentionally. It's okay. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> I tried that once. Um, Arya, can you respond in some way, even by typing? If you can hear me. Let's see. Where has she gone? I mean, I guess so she doesn't then. So. Yeah. Uh, let's take our break here, shall we? Yeah. Right. And we'll, we'll, yeah, so we'll, uh, we'll come back in 10 minutes, right? That. Oh. Yeah. Hey, we can hear an aria again. Yeah. Do it, can we? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that? yeah that wasn't it. Or am I hearing things? I'm sure I heard. Yeah, I'm sure I heard it as well. Voice. It's a mm -hmm. <laughs> That's where she typing. She typing. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, yeah. I see. She typing more. <laughs> Is it ever? Right. So who first find Google? Yeah, I was going to say. Well, let's um. How about we make a decision here then? Do you want to keep playing for like say another hour, or do you just want to wrap it up here and pick it up next time? Granted, next time might be who knows when. What's the? I think we'll, just... uh, well, let's take it's a wee not... break and then. No, come no, back. don't do that because I mean no. No, no, don't be daft. No. To be honest, it's not a bad place. I've been awake like six. Oh, right. Yeah. I'm sleepy. Yeah, Sorry, so I just it's... I just caught up in the chat. Uh. No, let's let's just call it a day there. Like, yeah, I would, I would say it's probably a good okay. place to put a pin in it because it is the kind of travel thing. So I'm assuming you're heading mm. towards Horizon. Mm -hmm. um, yes. On foot. Um, mm -hmm. Northeast, yeah, yeah. So every day add. Where are we here? Uh, Two hundred XP to their sheets. Yay! Yay. Wait, say two hundred or three hundred? I said two hundred. <laughs> you oh, know so I did. Nice one. Five, five eight. Five, Is that a thousand? Five nine no. zero zero should be. It should be, yeah. Oh, okay, well I'm fifty points down somewhere then. Yeah, so I don't want. Just I don't want. Yeah. Yeah. Sure you know, agree to that. Five nine zero zero five, should nine. be it. Yeah. Okay. I swear Yay. you, you auto-tune me out when we talk about XP all the time, Sophie. Honestly. <laughs> now, what are you naming in this session? I still think chicken fried ass or something like that, you know? Nah, That's I'm gonna just veto all that. We're just gonna mute yeah. Stu now. The Frenchman's hot. <laughs> Flaming hell. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why I just pictured freaking Ron Weasley. Fly me now! I quite like I'm this one personally, but. Uh, <laughs> you birthed the flame. <laughs> Flaming liar. <laughs> liar, liar, bows on fire. <laughs> 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 fire. Oh, yeah. Uh, Actually, that's not bad. That's right, that one. <laughs> liar, liar. Yep. Ring of fire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, I really uh, no, I'm yeah, that one, <laughs> yeah, that one, that one pretty much well sums it up. Uh, yep, I mean I that's that. that's three votes, so yeah, I would say that wins then. Um, that was easy to name that. Right. That um, as for the overall party goal, investigate what and or who is Mr. Flint. I'd say that seems to be ongoing. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yep. So we'll cycle back round to that next time. We won't focus too much on goals. <laughs> at the end here we'll just yeah. if everybody has a think about that because we're probably gonna have a lot of time to think about it let's put it that way and let us do our roundup with eric Oof! what a hot session that was <laughs> 
going to ban him from puns. <laughs> lose the hit point every time he makes a pun. <laughs> Whoa, don't get too heated about it, Reach. Yeah. <laughs> God. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. Uh, it's good. It's cool. Um, it wasn't. Yeah, carry on. <laughs> 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 if only your dice rolls were as good as your puns. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Burn, maybe? <laughs> oh dear. I mean, I have to make these puns because you guys like just throw shade at me all the time. I have to find something worth looking for. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Lord. What did you like about this session? What did you not like about this session? What's the what's the thoughts of Lord Eric Greenwood? He didn't shut the portal. Like, what the fuck? No, he's literally just walked away. Anything yeah, to come out like, what, what, what are we gonna do? Like, we, I suppose, like, harsh cuts to just yeah, and you left it open. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. But also, like, it kind of reinforces my point of going to the other one first, where the dragons could have been, where they could have shut the portal for us, but, you know, what else for me now? Mm. I mean, you could have went to the portal at any point. True. Or, like, an approximate location that way, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully that way. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Please, that direction hits hammer. <laughs> Goes forward two meters. <laughs> you might get five meters. You never know. <laughs> also, D and D sitting oh. back, going, "What's meters?" <laughs> there's a, there's a, a D one hundred. It's like, where do we go? <laughs> Somewhere between one and a hundred feet. Yeah. Um. Okay then. There's music. Are ya? Are yeah, you? Sorry, my phone went off. Are you speakable? Are ya? Do you want to do your? Your rundown for the the session. Um, well, I very much enjoyed the the bit where I had to convince people I'm not evil and you know I've been their friend all along. Mm. Oh wait, not people, just Grumbar. It's okay. Mm -hmm. His alignment's been adjusted. <laughs> Did oh. you actually change my alignment? Yep. <laughs> oh. 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 Damn boy. Mm. Um. How is that um, good? I thought it was a very interesting uh, <laughs> situation that, mm -hmm. that, that we were in, um, that I was in, being mm -hmm. like, you know... Hot um, water, you could say. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and... Um, You're welcome, Callum. Yeah. You lose hot <laughs> points as well. <laughs> no, I think Callum still loses them, but yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Yeah, uh, so I, I, I really like that and I still don't know what the deal is and why and you know I've I've got a lot of questions still. But hey, I have a fancy fancy bow now. Whoop right. whoop. Mm -hmm. Whoop whoop. Yeah, I'm a wee bit jealous. <laughs> mm. Yeah, we don't trust you with uh, fancy stuff come by, you'll just break it on the door. <laughs> Yay <laughs> You sure that you know what's what really is. funny? Hmm? Oh, I'll have to speak to Ryan about this. Okay, no, 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 I'll speak to Ryan about this person. <laughs> Secret oh, chat. I just had an idea. Yeah, 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 I just had an idea. I don't, don't like that. I don't, don't like me with my hammer, that's fine. I don't like this. <laughs> no, you, you guys gave me an idea. Uh -huh. Yeah, we'll keep, we'll, we'll keep that between us for now. Yeah, we find it'll be good. Yeah, I like it. Anything else you want to add, are you? I agree, it was actually quite fun to see, like, Crumber act. To actually engage in the fact that he's like, wait a minute, what is going on here? This is suspicious. I don't like things that crawl out of hell. <laughs> it was good. Mm. It was good. Uh, anything I should add? Um, nope, nope. Good, good. Um, I love the title. I honestly love the title. See, the last title has been, well, kind of super good last few actually. Exploding Kittens, Infernal Affairs, and Liar Liar Blows on Fire. <laughs> so good. Um, Grumba. Honestly, mate, I just really like the fact that I've literally spent all week thinking about how to deal with this session. <laughs> it is. It is. I'll be honest. I take the compliment, whether it's it intended or not. No, <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Like it, it is really good because I'm like, it's something that I've not just wanted to be like, wait for the 
kind of spur of the moment, see how what my opinion is. It's something that I've really wanted to think, had to think about, and I'm like, right, what do I actually want to try and happen next kind of thing? Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm glad it kind of, yeah, played out the way it did. Oh, it's been good. It definitely has been good. It's been good to actually see Crumbar engage, because a lot of parties, in my experience, just kind of don't try and rock the boat socially between the party dynamic a lot. And I think it's kind of important when things like this come up that it isn't just, well, we work together in a party. <coughs> Meta knowledge. <laughs> um, I think mm. it is healthy for the character to be like, I, my job is to kill demons that come from hell. You seem to what? have a friend from hell. Yeah. That is suspicious. So yeah, no, I'm... Even though I changed your alignment, there is no... It's not like I'm saying you shouldn't be doing this. It's just you will be judged for it, if that makes sense. So there are repercussions for things everybody does. Just like if Arya had said, yes, kill the half-orc. Yes. (laughs) Or if I told Arya to say, kill me. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. The, um... Yeah, no, that was really good. It's always fun yeah. when people get, kind of get lost in the immersion of the, the story and the, the drama and <laughs> no, de- the choices. Defini- definitely, I have to. Th- I, I think this has been my most like excitable session yet. Awesome. I'm glad the giant fiery yeah. hole was exciting. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I was more interested in the Frenchman's hut. I'm not yeah. gonna lie. Not but... confused with the Frenchman's hut. Uh, um, yeah. yeah, once you get the date in before we had the Frenchman's hut. <laughs> Anything else you want to add? Uh, yeah, I'm just glad I didn't die. Yeah, me too. I'll be honest. Yeah, I was super good. glad I did was not die. Mm. I was honestly expecting you to smack it more with hammer, and I thought, God, it will probably yeah. stab him again. On- honestly, that was a thing that I have been thinking about. Mm. Um, yeah. but yeah, I can, I, can I just? The, yeah, go for it. Sorry. I was going to say, can I point out that I did not smack things with hammer once in this? Mm. In fact, Eric did, in fact, smack things with a hammer. So, cool. Brutal bones. Mm. They are no longer bones, they are dust. <laughs> I like how you're having your mini god complex over by the altar. <laughs> 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 Lord, it rain wood. And then in the background, this big roaring inferno and stuff. <laughs> Well, they all have an argument at the side. Uh, I do love that. Um, now, I like the idea, the visual of like Crumbar stopping fighting that thing and be like, wait, are you the real threat? And then both the suit of armor thing looking at her, being like, why are you not listening to me, mistress? Hey, listen. And Crumbar being like, hey, everybody, listen to me. She seems shifty. And both of them with their hands on their hips staring at her, expecting answers. That's quite mm-hmm. a cool visual. Um, I do like that. Um, what about yourself then, Kitty? I just the funniest bit that sticks out to me is like going over to inspect the altar and like just seeing electric <laughs> like scorch marks, like God's sake. <laughs> Contaminated yeah. crime scene instantly. <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean I'm kinda of disappointed we haven't sorted anything about the hole, but we do need more help on that because we have tried several things. Mm. Like we have no idea how to tackle that to be fair, so could have shot it with lightning. Mm. Well, did you though? No. Uh, well, I didn't think it was a good idea. <laughs> I'm just saying I could have. Got me, I've never heard of firefighters actually firing lightning at a fire to see if they'll put it out. So, <laughs> probably, yeah. Fight fire with fire is not quite yeah. <laughs> accurate. <laughs> I mean, wasn't that the theory behind her firing her bullet yes. at it, though? Yeah, like, wasn't it the exact <laughs> theory? <laughs> that was more to do with the being that is now in her bow. That might have been, like, no. the key. That's what my thought mm. behind it was. My thought was, old fire, put new fire, burn each other out, right? <sighs> yeah, that's awesome. how fire works. Mm-hmm. I was actually saying that the fireball enemy is the safest place to fire. So it wasn't that <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it, they all seem reasonable. Yeah. Fire, yes. <laughs> if they're sure that they're okay. No. Okay. Now keep in mind as well, like, see if you do feel strongly as your character or even just as a player. 
it is worth mm. voicing those opinions as well. Like, it's, there's nothing to say, guys. I actually genuinely think we should try and suss out something to do here, or do we go yeah. get somebody else? Like, it's totally valid to be like, I know you have all decided to walk away, but maybe you turn around and see me still standing there and staring at the fire, yeah. being like, but big fire. <laughs> <laughs> Um, which I kind of <laughs> love. <laughs> what, if, what is it? Um, Quick, oh, bring marshmallows. The, the Will Smith meme where he's like, look at my wife. Mm-hmm. He's like, the fire. Look yep. at the fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, um, it is always worth like having those thoughts as well. Like, There's nothing wrong with like disagreeing with each other, right? Um, I think that's, that's valid, especially if it makes you know, sense also. I did find it perfect. Um, good giffage. No. Not a good giffage. Uh, reach. <laughs> as can kind of tough how we are pretty much, we haven't, it feels as though we haven't done anything, but actually we've done as much as we can. Mm-hmm. Uh, we do need to go back and get help. This is well our area of expertise. Mm. Uh, just... 10 levels more, I would think, probably. At least five anyway. I would say the interesting thing, right, so Eight days to get here from being assigned the task, and that was already showing up on Justoria's radar. And then it's developed that far by the time you get there, weirdly coincidentally, when you show up. And then you're going to travel back, and it's just interesting to see what happens in that time, because it depends how long you take to get back as well. Which I use the hammer. Which, by the way, Arya or myself, I think should do the point. So somebody help me if we're doing it next, if, or unless Arya can do it. Right. I'll help. Just a wee bit of men again. <laughs> just chucking that. He's going to have Eric starting to throw the hammer in front and then running up to it and grabbing it and throwing it again, playing fetch with himself, just no, so they can no. pretend to actually be leading the party. I'd be spawning little storm clouds, and as I hit it with my hammer, I'd be d- slowly pinging them really far away, so it looks like I'm doing home runs. <laughs> <laughs> Clunk, storm. Anything else you want to add, Reach? Uh, nah, it's just as yeah, it's opened up questions more. But yeah, I like that though, because I like the fact that Crumbar turned to you and was like, "But this is what we <laughs> fight." And then it clicks to like yeah. Arya standing there with like her blue hair and her bow and her nature affectation, being like, "Hi." Uh, <laughs> 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 All I did was heal him the whole time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's good. I am enjoying it. I am. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see what you do. My assumption is he's are heading back to Horizon to speak to Justoria. That's yeah. the. the is that, probably the best best idea, but going straight north to the other one is also a good idea, which is mm-hmm. debatable. Uh, but. It's also a possibility, yeah. You know where the two locations were to investigate, so you could do both and then go back, or go back and deal with that one, but then it gives the other well, one a lot more time to develop. I'd say go back, because if we turn, go up there and there's a giant flaming portal in the, at that one, and we don't know how to close it, then... Mm. No. But... The other thing is, if we've got a quick way back, if that bracelet turns into a, a one-way ticket straight back, then we're probably quicker going straight up north, looking at that way, then taking a quick route back. That's... But my hammer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Also, you imply that I want to spend a lot of company right now with Aria, mm. whereas my <laughs> thinking is just Storia would maybe be able to shed some light on this situation. Assuming she'll know? even meet with you guys, right? Because remember, she did say we shouldn't have much contact anymore. Fuck, that's a good point. Mm. And you have literally went to a giant flaming hole in the ground, some weird demony thing came out of it, then seemed to live in her bow now, and then you have, you're going to head back and be like, we went to that giant flaming pit thing for you, remember? Let's hope your dad isn't watching. Yeah, that's a good point. Fuck. Yeah. So, yeah, there's a lot to think about, I think, for next time. I'm excited. Um, I think what I'll probably try and do, unless I come up with some mad inspiration in the time between now and then, will be that we'll probably start as you clear the direwood. 
and either back into the open terrain and you can maybe make your decisions from there so you can have a think about what you want to do because I think that's a good starting point to let you go right what do you want to do and we can montage to that scene if we have to can be Horizon, can be the other hellhole, can be somewhere else, could be Glitterhagen for here, you could all jump into the abyss, could go back to the flaming hellhole. It's up to you, have a think about it, yep. chat about it. So, I think that's been pretty good. Uh, it was a good session, I liked it. We went through, obviously, in one big part, I enjoyed that. We were going to stop and break it up, but I think it's a good place to stop here. Thanks for playing, guys. No problem, bro. No, no, thank you. <laughs> 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 Goodbye, everyone. No, honestly, the more we get, the oh, more yeah. we oh. play, the better it gets. Cool. So awesome. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, no, it has. It's been really, really good. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Excellent. Good. Uh, goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye, people. Bye. Bye. Bye.